Hello everybody, what the fuck is up? Yeah, I'm gonna do some more visual novel today, you know, you know, the story, you know, just like the life I've been having for days now. <laughs> Right, um, yeah, so I guess I'm gonna get started with everything now. I gotta, you know, put my head up. It is getting a little bit cold. And yeah, I suppose we're gonna get started with everything. I'm really excited for today. Yesterday was a really positive start. And yeah, as much as I know that possi possibility, positivity is probably gonna disappear at some point in the foreseeable future. I just wanna, you know, make the most of the moments really. I'm kind of excited for this. Kind of. Really excited for this. Um, right, I gotta I gotta just quickly see how was my face cam. Yes, yeah, good. Right. Um yeah. Twelve eleven AM oh, yes. My favourite oh, time. So oh really? Oh really, your parents getting home, huh? They smell like energy drinks and their eyes were all bloodshot. Oh god. <laughs> they said I had a crazy amount of stuff to do when we're up two nights whole in a row. Jesus Christ. I don't have a dust. I was thinking that. It's it's actually kind of funny because, like, the more you live life, the more shitty it becomes sometimes. <laughs> like, it's so funny. Your dad is an artist, right? God, my audio is so loud. I'm gonna get like that ear disease where you get like rumbling in your ear if I don't be careful <laughs> they really do have it rough I was just joking by the way come to think of it he was wasn't he I would very much like to see what kind of things he draws sometime an artist huh I've seen a number of watercolor and acrylic paintings on display but he had to be doing some other job too just what did dad do exactly he didn't let anyone into his workshop after all I wanted to sneak peek one day <laughs> so the, was, the, the house was empty for two days after all that. <laughs> that didn't leave much time. So, Gitan, did you manage to go after the character who was in your... <laughs> what the fuck? The absence of your parents is a must-have for a, a rogue protagonist. <laughs> he got up a lot of relationship points and raised up all the right flags. <laughs> I have no idea what any of you are talking about. <laughs> hmm. That means you don't need to cook for yourself anymore, Kitchen. What did you make last night? Last night. Hmm, hmm. In the end, I I didn't make a single thing myself. Last night's dinner, well, it was vegetable stir fry. Well, Kitchen, you can make a little bit of real cooking now. Yeah, he can. He can definitely make real cooking. He just. He just kind of has the thing called friends. <laughs> hmm. You got vegetable stir fry. Did it come out good? Did it? Nana-san, you're being unpleasant. Why are you clinging on to me? 
<laughs> and this is me when I finally dish was together. Oh, oh no. Nice. Hey, I said you're being unfussed. <laughs> huh? What are you talking about? Me, I'm utterly confused. Ask me some some clarification, but I barely, albeit transparently, averted my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Right, does everyone have plans for this afternoon? You don't, do you? Today was Saturday, the beautiful day on which we were liberated from the confines of school in the afternoon. Oh my god, I keep on forgetting these people have Saturday school. God, poor fucking bastards. Japan City has Saturday schools? Oh my god. Actually, the school in Hinamazawa had slightly different Saturdays than those in the city. There were a lot of students who were here. Um, here who brought a bento, ate it at lunch, and then wanted to play in the school, went to play in the school around the school year. But uh, you could say that the entire school turned into a children's playground. There were mountains behind the school, and if you went down that way, you'd find mountain streams. Hmm. You could avoid the strong sunlight and make conversation in the classroom if you wanted to. You could also play hide and seek in the construction pipes. Oh my god, that must be fun. Of course, you were free to go home as well. There were some kids who went home and helped towater the fields or tended stores. Oh, that must actually be really cool. So you can just be in school. It's no, it's no academic setting. It's just like you know, fuck around really. That must be cool. I wouldn't want to do that in my school though. They probably wouldn't even trust us because of how like rogue some people are in our school. They'd probably just steal stuff if they could. If Mion was bringing up the afternoon like this, then it must have been for some crazy big club event. However, sadly, I have something I needed to do before taking part in whatever it was. What? You have work? That's unlucky. Wait, Casey has something to do? I wonder what kind of work it is. Maybe it's helping with his father with his artwork job. What does he have to do, I wonder? Hmm, I'll be your mother for his father. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Bruh. <laughs> I looked into Dennis' eyes and saw myself. What? Oh my god. <laughs> no, no, I wouldn't do that for a million yet. Good reaction. Good reaction. <laughs> to get into Dennis' delusions, I grabbed a hang and swung him from side to side. Anyway, what are these people thinking? Bro, is this dad just gonna paint, like, you know, of his son? That's just weird. Oh, stop. <laughs> I was already leaving when I fanciful decisions decide I have something to do real quick during lunch. Is it okay? I'm okay to meet up with you after it's done though. What does he have to do? Interesting. Right during lunch. Bro. I see, that sounds kind of cool actually. What could it be? Are we having a bank with the VIP experts like a visit lunch? Uh, this is truly sad that you're right. Oh god. <laughs> what? Well, everyone shouts wildly surprised. Ow, my eyes. <laughs> oh god, so he's gonna have a lunch with like business representatives. That must be terrifying. He's gonna he's gonna have to be so formal. It was true today I'll be on the job with my family. For my dad's job he was having about ten people ten people, God, from the publishing agency over for a house party. He called people in from work at the party day after having stayed up two nights in a row. I'm amazed at their vitality. Adults have it prop have it pretty rough. Of course it would be incredibly uncomfortable for me. It would really be really tiring. I have to force myself to smile with some old dudes I didn't know. But they're my dad has important business connection, so offending them would be bad. Well, with all that said, it was going to get very uncomfortable for me today, starting at lunch. No, I don't blame him. So that's interesting, like, I suppose in Casey, he's like, he's really good at talking to his friends, and yet he can't talk to the general public. I always had the impression that, like, if you can confidently talk to friends, you can also confidently talk to the general public, but no, I suppose. Well, what an intelligent job. This is my son, Casey. Casey, this is Honda-san. He's a publisher, and his person here is Inoue. Inoue san he works as a printer. Say your hello. Hello, my name is Casey. I appreciate all you've done for my father. Casey, do you draw pictures like your father does? I would very much like to see them. <laughs> oh, my dad has a pleasure of praising the face and that of an artist, although I don't really know what kind of things he creates. I don't really care and I don't want to see anyway. That's what I type is to the artist, so he doesn't allow them to show me very often anyway. Damn. I'm not kind of I'm not a kid anymore, so I wouldn't care at all if they were pieces. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, if you study under your father as an apprentice, you will be able to put on a great artist of too. Excuse me, this is just between you and me, but <clears throat> my dad, is he really that great of an artist? I read it myself and whispered my question. It might have 
<gasps> Super Mario Sun be asking this, but when I did, he gave me this really strange grin. <laughs> And tried to cramp down onto my shoulders. Yes, he is truly, truly a fantastic hunt. Oh. <laughs> that could have gone so wrong. Is that so? I'm glad to hear it. There were no casual restrictions. He does fan service and he always answers the letters he gets. Damn. He has an inquisitive mind and always on the prowl for what the world needs. Taking off your Absolutely not. I'm confused. <laughs> that goes for glasses and school uniforms too. Oh god, my brother says he understands his... Oh no! Every event seems to be on the wall with a huge lineup. I'm sorry, but his pictures are not the one. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I think I know what he's implying. <laughs> and they're the corners and finally climbing up the corner of the bunch of paths. What I want to say is... Uh, in the last chapter, how did Katie get introduced to Sion? It was through Angel Mort, who asked to go to Angel Mort. Yeah, his father. <laughs> I have a feeling he's a little bit sus. The final destination is the famous wall. You too, please become a great artist who can disgrace words in unison with my ballad sense. I'll cheer you on. It's fine to have a lot of passion for the things you like, but I didn't get it. But it seemed that the world of art ran pretty deep. It was probably a much deeper world than I could have imagined. I decided to leave it at that. But then I realized my mom was calling me from the other side of the room. Katie, it's the phone. It's a friend of yours. A lucky break. Oh my god. Maybe I could pull out of this uncomfortable business party by using a friend's phone. Cool. Uh, that's an excuse. I scampered over to the front corner and snatched up the receiver my mom had left there. Hello, it's me. Hello, me. That's not how you answer the phone, yes, son. I employ you to learn how to choose your words no, properly. I was of the opinion that the person is speaking to me had a far stranger way of talking. Oh, it's Abagon. It's unusual for you to meet. Um, they call my house. This isn't the time for pleasure for his kiss on. When are you going to be able to come? I'm sorry, it looks like this is going to be a bit long. I can't get them to let me go. Um, I want to do things with the club now, but that's not it, yes, son. It wasn't about club today. It's a real battle. Saldivar's voice was different than normal. I could feel the urgency in it drifting through the phone. A real battle? That doesn't sound like a situation. I will explain the particulars when we meet. Anyway, this is a terrible crisis. At this rate, we're going to lose. What on earth was going on? Could it have been a fight? I didn't know who they were, but laying a hand on something else was, oh, was an absolutely <laughs> terrible idea. Right, got it. Okinomi and Posse, by the way, where are you are? We're at the Okinomi Elementary School campus. What? That's a weird place to be. They have campuses for elementary schools in Japan as well. There are signs at the station so you'll be able to figure it out anywhere in a huge hurry. The school campus, the situation could have a lot of people involved. Could it have turned into an all out war? Who's the enemy here anyway? Oh, I'm on fire. Got it, I'll be there soon. Should I bring a weapon with me? Like a metal baseball bat or something? You have a metal bat? That would be fantastic. Oh my god. Looks like shit's really hit the fan. We'll wait for you here. The cool cut off abruptly. I needed to hurry. Oh, Casey, I was looking for you. Diggity Sam was hoping that for his next Dozinshi. Oh. <laughs> That's all the time. Then we have a bat, a metal bat. If not, then anything that will do. If anything that will do, then my golf clubs are in the story room. <laughs> it didn't have the same kind of impact, but a golf club was a splendid weapon too. It was lighter than a baseball bat, and maybe easier than me to use. Thanks, I'm borrowing one. I really need to go see my friends for something. It's urgent. Um, sorry. What, Katie? Wait a minute. Oh, is this the... Oh, oh no, it's just that. <laughs> I grabbed the golf club, jumped on my bike, and headed straight for town. Yeah. Bro, lucky. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna just... Yeah. Wait me, Satoko. I'll be right there. Just hold on until then. I didn't actually know where Walking Nomi High Elementary was exactly, but Sato Girl's phone call seemed to demand urgency, so I rushed out without asking her about how to get there. <laughs> but if I went to the station, there would be signs. At least I felt like that's what she said. Then I heard the jingling of a bicycle bell from behind me. Oh! Hello, hey, look at Little bit of a coincidence. Katie, you came quickly. You put the pedal to the metal. <laughs> Damn, this isn't the time to be out of breath. I need to hurry. I'm sorry, where is Walking Nomi High Elementary? I'll show you the way. Come along with me. And we got on off on our bike. I followed her. So the girls suddenly called me out here, but what on earth is going on anyway? I thought we had the advantage. However, they called in a helper. It's bad manners. A helper? What cow is calling with the reinforcement the minute that they re realize they lose? They're taking everybody out one by one. We can't put a dent in them. Oh shit. God, sounds like they were pretty strong. Anyway, I'll ask about it later. We don't have time, right? Please hurry. 
お任せなのです。Leave it to me. When Fudikachan leading the way, we headed straight for the elementary school grounds. I asked Fudikachan something during that time. It seemed like all the, the club members behind me were part of this fight. Damn, so what we all was trying to tell that everyone was that this would happen. <laughs> If I had known that, I would have just ditched my family job, but it was too late for regrets. According to the Kachan, we had a one sided advantage at the start, but our angling foes had brought in a powerful ally. The club members put a resistance and we went against them one by one, apparently. But apparently, they couldn't stand up to them. Oh god. The combined evidence of the whole club couldn't win. Just what kind of monster is this guy? <laughs> He's amazing, the enemy is orthodox. Orthodox? Weird, so they weren't using like his ruling tactics, but actually had a study karate or something. So what she meant. Casey is our last ray of home now. Off normally our elementary came into view. I can hear many voices raising hell over there. Whoa, Mio. Then I'll start to go. I'll be there soon. I'll cross the moon once. There were a lot of bicycles left out in the front of the school. I left mine um, there next to them in the same way. I could tell there were a lot of people flooding the canvas. With the two armies in the midst of a huge no holds barred bull. I took my golf club in hand. Whoosh, I swung it. I felt the sensation of it sticking firmly to my palm. Great, the feedback wasn't bad. I was going all out with this thing. I tossed at a breakneck speed to the school gate, swinging it around. Oh, that's <laughs> such a bad idea! Come on, Nikatan. I will show you what the mighty manly warrior my brother Daisy can really do. <laughs> wow, Daisy, you're so reliable. You're going to rampage with a golf club. <laughs> Nikatan applauded me through the little dryly lording my valiance the manny my brother Casey put it behind him and headed for the place where he may die <laughs> but Casey, why did you ring the golf club today i had no choice the first time i figured a baseball bat would have been good but we didn't have one in my house a golf club is fast better than going bad bare handed so i brought one a oh, very excellent i'll give you a pat on the head i can't wait to see your golf club rampage despite the emergency situation because i'm um reached up and struck me on the head hey, hey this is no time for jokes oh, crack just then, an extremely loud metallic sound rang out, and I heard many people cheering. Left off. Uh, oh, we missed. Run, you can get to second base. Go oh my god, are they playing round us? <laughs> Seem to calm down, send it to the third. I sent a field to call the ball, and after a brief pause, sent it flying to third base. If he pitched it wildly and might get there, he gave up on second and threw it third with time to spare. The instructions from the bench, they were solid. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh my god, okay, skin see it's not a good Oh my god. So, it wasn't like something actually of importance. It was a baseball game. <laughs> you're like, you're like, loving around is only okay when you do it at the bread shop. <laughs> oh, is he the year? No way. It's actually the first time we see him, I think. It's my bad, Akun kid. Will you really be able to save us? We're, we're up against us elite schools ace. Left arm, Kamedaku. To be able to be a Korsian class pitcher, he must be a god. Oh, that's okay. I'm sure the case can, can turn on the tables. He's a really dependable person. I am curious, what does EDS art style look like in. Oh my god! <laughs> that's weird. <laughs> Mama, what? He's the pinch hitter that we brought in to take out. Left my Kameda with his bullet fastball. The one who had no hit, no run game after another during the regional qualifiers, the undefeated demon pitcher of Voicema. <laughs> what? I'm confused. I haven't got a sandwich. <laughs> I don't get what you mean. But yeah, welcome, bro. Hope it's going well for you. The, the super high school level pitcher that had already been marked against, uh, already been marked by professional scouts. He's going to win against him. So a reasonable pitcher like that is no match for Kirsten. We send his pros all the way back um, for an easy victory. <laughs> Mama, mama, there was a slugger like that in the prefecture. I had no idea. He must have gone under the radar. Hey, that scout stood up. Hey, take a history to our office. Um, hey, take a picture. His full name is Maya Barakeji. Look him up in the database and send his history to our office. Oh, Maya oh. Which one is Maya Barakeji? Son, picture, pictures. Oh, all oh, right. Interesting. I've never heard of that store before. What is it? Is it like, I don't know if you've heard of it, but is it like an American Greg's or something like that? 
I hold her this was the honest, led by Sapper Girl, gripped the cameras tightly and said for the room in my Badagiti. <gasps> oh my god, as me, I was so dazed as to what was happening that I froze him in place with my golf club up in the air. There's like this one over here. <laughs> yeah, the camera people would and instead of me through their viewfinders and just like that they turned to stone <laughs> and that was what they got and the picture that my barricade was a golf club <laughs> oh my god he didn't know it was baseball <laughs> nobody could seem to understand why i was holding something like this and at this point neither did i cheap 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 a cold greasy sweat drip from me the first one to break the northern northern layer called signups was dinner um, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> May we ask you a question? <laughs> please, please don't. Psychic waves of my entreaty flowed out from my face along with my sweat. It's somehow seemed to reach the two of them. <laughs> the definitely quite ripples is all parted as Moses once parted the sea. <laughs> but Moses probably didn't go through the parted seas this quietly. <laughs> if you're playing baseball, then tell me from the start. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, interesting. Is it better than Subway? It's actually kind of odd that, like, Subway's so popular in, like, America and England, really. I mean, like, it's it's just so popular in, like, some of the stores that I've been in. Like, it's in every single co-op shop, genuinely. Maybe there's a few that it's not in, to be fair, but, like, nearly every single, like, actually good co-op shop it's in. So it's just really hard to believe that, like, it's not an English thing. It's really, it's really crazy. The thing is about Subway, I actually really, I kind of like it, but my parents won't let me try anything, like, actually interesting on the menu. Because they don't trust the food, so, yeah, fun. Oh god, yeah, I'm fucking dreading summer. To be fair though, we are in the mid of May, and it's still 9 degrees, like, I can still wear a hoodie. Which is not that bad, but like still, I'm really dreading, you know, summer, June, especially, that's going to be hell on earth. What? Did I say that? I mean, I thought, I thought, I told you to, look at, I told you to come to the campus with a baseball bat, what else could you have thought it was? And what matter of thing he got you to mistakenly bring a cold club Um, I think, I think Giskin must have done it on purpose to dance in our moves and get us pumped, I think. I think. <laughs> then I smiled bitterly and got them for me with all her might. Please believe her, everyone. I'm begging you. <laughs> Katie loves golf. Pet, pet. Little time starting back to my head of Rob grin on her face all the while. <laughs> Gods. Holy shit, is that actually true? Oh my god, how how hot is it in terms of like degrees Fahrenheit or Celsius, whichever one you want to pick? God, that sounds so scary. I pushed that hand away, grabbed the mouth from behind the suspenders and picked him up like a kitten. <laughs> Me. Me. Because, um, why don't you tell me it was a baseball game when we met at the station? I wouldn't have to stop such a disgrace. <laughs> because I was fine, it was like the sun, so incredibly innocent. Oh, uh, she's glowing. When I saw it, because I was really smart, I couldn't help but feel like I forgive everything she did. Bruh, simp. If it got humble, I actually would, then she'd have another thing coming. Anyway, this is your punishment. Then <laughs> Meep. Because I'm still, um, picked up on my... And I offered her to dinner. <laughs> That's right. The kids in the fire because I'm sent. I was vaulted into my vajat. Oh god. <laughs> I'll take her. Then I will take her. So cute. <laughs> I was then I'll stop it. What the fuck? <laughs> I feel really bad for her because I'm so cute. Because I'm so cute. Oh, God, what am I playing? We're gonna hold her tight as a vise and we're going to get her. For <laughs> this is. This is kind of like not okay. What you said, bro. Oh my fucking God. 
Si je pense que tu es là, 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 What the uh, fuck? What yeah, I recently found out that Ikatan is incredibly cute. Oh my god, please. <laughs> I'm gonna take you home. <laughs> For the moment, I just gave her a little three minute time out. <laughs> this is. This is. I hate that stuff like this is normalized. <laughs> like the way I had to call that. I didn't call it was a baseball game. Oh, holy shit, that's, that's bad for, my god. I remember last year was 37 degrees in middle of June, something like that. It's ridiculous. It really was. Oh no, sorry, it was 30 degrees. It was somewhere around like 30 degrees. It was a fucking nightmare. I feel really bad for you. Bro, this is not an ele- it, it shouldn't be an elementary school, but it is. <laughs> oh, what happened then? Yes, Oscar, right. you said you had a house party with your family. I suppose I was wrong to ask, but at times I troubled that you seem obviously must prioritize friends over family. I felt like that's what I was supposed to say, not you. Well, it was just a business party for my dad, I guess. I honestly felt proud to be going down here. So, what's the crisis situation like that? Six to seven, which means our team is losing, huh? <laughs> Two hours in the bottom of nine? What the hell? Oh god, this game, oh no, this game is always about to end. We would have a little more time if you had gotten here sooner. Do you have any idea how difficult it was for us to hold out this long? Oh, 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 I'm sorry, okay, so what am I doing? Am I going to be the pitch hitter? Just leave it to me. It may not look like it, but I went to the batting cages a lot before I moved here. Oh. My dad went there for fun and I used to go over him pretty open. Oh my god. That's brutal, Jesus. 46 degrees Celsius. Oh, God. That is threatening, let's just say that. God, I can't imagine how hot Australia is. If that's America. I mean, wasn't there in, like, Canada a really massive, um, I don't know, not like, heat wave but just massive sort of cold temperature period like really really cold temperatures i mean like abnormally cold because i swear i swear there was like something minus 10s or 20s oh god that's that's still really bad though i mean yeah but i went there for just a fun I'm pretty confident about just hitting the back with the ball, but vroom, I'm trying to learn the sounds I'm out like the ways of which like the likes of which I'd never heard before. The cat just mid trembled, sending up a light cloud of dust, telling me the tremendous sound had come from the ball. <gasps> oh no, hey, no, wait a second. What's up with that crazy fast ball anyway? Oh no, the ball's fast? Surprise, yeah, that's a bona fide Gaussian level picture. <laughs> Don't you know about left arm Kanadaku, the high school where he's famous in sports? He's famous? Oh no. Sorry, can't say I do. Wait, Mio, what happened to you? <laughs> Mio showed up and to my surprise he was wrapped up in bandages? Just what on earth happened? Oh my god. Well, he came here late, so I guess we need to explain from the beginning. Oh, hmm. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh god. God, that's insane. That must have been literal living hell for the people. There. God. Because, I mean, in temperatures like that, I think they're probably at the point where, like, any surface you touch is just molten. Like, I mean, I remember when it's really hot, if you, for example, I don't know. Let's say if you touch, like, the plate of a car, it, it will just literally burn you. Oh my god. God, that really is serious. God. Well, it's good to think you're happy. You're careful then. Wow. Jesus. God, I'm sorry to hear that. But I can I can see why though. That heat is... I mean, they're not... Firstly, they're not accustomed... 
Oh yeah, that's smart. Like, firstly, the people there, they're not accustomed to that much heat. And secondly, they're just... I mean, to be fair, I think it probably would be kind of hard to die from a heat stroke, but like, there's circumstances in everybody's lives that sort of provoke the risks, really. Oh, oh, that could probably explain it. Oh my god. I didn't realise that. Holy shit. That... Wow. God, that must have been a challenge to live through. Wow. Yep, I had a lot of others. He's so cute. <laughs> yeah, it just... Oh my god. I just... I'm... <laughs> oh, what did I do because I was cheap? What the fuck? Bro, these people are... They're so weird. I almost put my own to leave the switch, but I put the stop to it using logic. Oh my god. <laughs> we have... Then Arcee's like... Yeah. I couldn't imagine what then I was going to do in the future. <laughs> oh my god. I was an adult. He is not an adult. He's my age. Okay, explain anyway. How do things get screwed up enough that Kossien relief picture ended up in a baseball game for fun? Uh, see you when you're back. Hope you have fun with eating. Everybody has changed glasses then. Glasses. Then then I spoke for all of them. Mm -hmm. At first, well, it was just a normal baseball game. It's, not, it's nothing much, just a little grudge between the Namizawa fighters and the Okinomiya titans. We were having just a grand old time, really nothing much. Well, in simple terms, well, in simple terms it was an in, in tramoral in match. I managed to settle the grudge between the Amazon and Rocky and Mia. We say grudge, but it's all pretty cool and friendly. So, why is a whole part, part of it? Some, some of you are wearing more than the uniform, some of you are. <coughs> Last time I checked, we weren't the school baseball team. Oh, that is well. Pretty irresponsible. Oh, did they sneak in? Oh, right, they happened to have some players who couldn't make it today. They were pretty down in the dumps, so we ended up getting involved post haste. I see, so if. There weren't enough members, anyone could come to the rescue, whether boy or girl, and no matter what grade they were in. The jumble together feeling was the hallmark of our school. But Ika san told me they were crossing him at the beginning. He's an amazing batter, if he was hitting home runs left and right. Oh damn. Of course. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> Some things don't bear close detail required. Doing so seemed to hurt her somehow, and she groaned pathetically. <laughs> <laughs> yes, every time Yo-san went after to the bat, she hit the home run and brought everyone on the bases in. Damn. Unless other ones you can actually hit them for. Oh, 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 oh. Meep. <laughs> Alright, I think I got the gist of it. So you were having a pretty easy time with that course again picture. Showed up. That's right, it was all of us at, it was all us at the beginning. Maybe we didn't get that many points, but we were able to get people on the bases. Oh, Kamadaku just happened to show up to watch the day today. Apparently, Kameda, um, Kameda, that is a very well known school in our prefecture that frequently sent people to Kosuke. Oh. Oh, right. I thought that said attacks. Interesting. And this man known as the ace of the baseball team, Kamada, seems to be quite skilled. <laughs> now that I thought about it, it was certainly strange to see a cameraman with the journalist armbands here towards a casual baseball game start out in the sticks like this. I heard that when Kamada was little, he was on the Okinomiya Titans. Oh, damn. He figured it out, right? His own team was losing, so that's why he jumped in this relief picture and took the mound. Yo, welcome! Wait, I don't know. I don't know, dude. Do you want Do you want me to say, like, your name or stream? Because I know it or everything. Or should I just call you, like, Trick Length or Trick or whatever? <laughs> but, yeah, welcome. Yeah, I know. These people, these people, they are... Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, welcome, Trick. How is it going? No, I, I get what you mean. These people, 
these people, they're sort of, they're sort of all, um, they're sort of all like different ages really. It's really fun just, you know, playing the whole visual novel thing. Because the thing is about these people, they're, they're so interesting in terms of like a friend group. No, it's just terrible. We can't even hit any foul balls, much less get anyone on base. But still, of course, you have to get to Barty in. It's unfair. We're just playing for fun. Oh, if you don't know what's currently happening in um, this stage of the visual novel, I mean, there's a ton of story that's not just like fun and games in this, but currently what's happening is there's been a baseball match. Emergency. Really good baseball players came in, just completely taking out everyone. <laughs> and yeah, as a result, everybody's just needing to, you know, like just cool for backup. Like the main character, he was at a sort of really important business lunch and yet he still needed to come just because these people were so nervous about losing. It was an emergency apparently. <laughs> Joe Weber. <laughs> I, I don't even know what you mean. Yeah, I'm doing all right as well, thanks. Had a pretty good day. It's good to hear that you're doing good as well. It's been fun. All the boys watching the Hinamazawa fighters uniform were hanging their heads in disappointment. I knew almost all of their faces. And isn't everybody here a classmate? Oh, I see. We're the only school in Hinamazawa after all. Oh, it's Tommy Taku. What a You were on the baseball team too. My bad, Asaho. Bro, this dude. This dude. <laughs> um. Uh, let me think about it. I'm not entirely sure, because, like, you know, I have school and everything, but... I don't know. I don't know. The only the only thing is about, like, the whole VC thing is, like, I've got so many things going on in my life at the moment that I don't even know if I can fit it in. His uniform was brand new and not very dirty, fresh off the presses. Damn. I can see handmade banners with their names written on them in the grandstands. Yeah... Yeah, sorry dude, it's just like, I have I have so many things, I mean, yeah. Oh, nice one. What was it? I see, their families came to root for them in their debut game today. <laughs> Okamura-kun said he brought his back today as a present from his dad. Oh, right, so they're like, you know, sort of supportive of it. The brand new bat sparkled. With that kind of present, a man has just has to perform well. <laughs> He had a swinging a whole lot just for today. Tomita-san, he went too far and he's all the skin. Oh god! It wasn't like his tall hand would have looked like it hurt, but from that injury you could sense his backbone. I get it guys, you wanted to make your big moment a good one. <laughs> the saber of the Okonomiya Titans, we could hear the sounds of, his, of Kamadakun's tremendous fastball practice. Oh! Oh, that's really cool! Oh, that is GG on that. I mean, yeah, I I'll tell you what, I was I was thinking, like, in the summer holidays when I have, like, a ton of time just really try-harding in terms of, like, learning sort of Photoshop and thumbnail creation. 15 quid. Wow. God, keep on going. Keep on going. Try and promote that because if you could... If you can get, like, really... If you can use your thumbnail-making talent for, like, really good sort of purposes then uh, that is some sweet cash there <laughs> oh my god nice one wow this was no joke he was definitely on a level far above for high school kids oh yeah that's a really good idea people need that type of stuff they really do there's so many gfx opportunities as well like badges games game thumbnails game covers even clothes. Oh yeah, yeah, sure. Um, but at his level, he clearly shouldn't have been interrupting the grass lock game. Grudge match, though it may have been. He should have understood how much better he was too. <laughs> this guy, was he being serious about opponents like these? <laughs> yeah, but then I think it's immature. And then as I screwed hard, it took a lot to get that on <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I'm just on the DM thing now, so yeah. As for Tomei Takun or Nakamura-kun, 
they were uh, sniffling, fighting back tears. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, you you have mastered effects. Holy shit. Oh, I love how everything looks like so sort of embedded. You can sort of, from all the text, you just sort of see like it's... I don't know, it's like... It's sort of part of the level. Oh, I love that aerial one. That one's probably my favourite so far. Oh, that 58 one's also really good. Oh my god. Oh, these are so good. Wow. God, that is really bloody cool. Yeah, you deserve money for them. <laughs> wow. No, that's really good to wear. I mean, I don't know. I've never, I've never really got into thumbnail making, honestly. Like... It's one of those things, however, like, I feel I kind of, I really need, I really am going to need a better PC if I actually want to sort of, you know, do it. Because at the moment my PC is just complete dog water, but yeah. Once I've saved up for like all my music gear, I'm actually thinking of getting, you know, like, really good PC. Um, oh, I don't, I mean, it is kind of you to us, but like, the thing is with my thumbnails, I kind of feel like... I kind of feel like with all of my content, I, I sort of want to be like the only person sort of involved because it it just doesn't really feel like fully my work if I sort of if I sort of don't do everything myself, if you get what I mean. We had another tremendous noise from the mitt. I turned around and this left half Kamadakun guy was looking at us and grinning boldly. <laughs> anyway, that's how it is. Now it's came to this, we have no choice. We have to engage in real battle. Yeah, it looks like we have to get serious. <laughs> Bro, I love this club. They they treat a base a baseball game like it is genuine tryhard material. <laughs> that would actually be pretty interesting. I mean, so you actually do it on Photoshop as opposed to Pixlr now. That's really cool. We tried getting serious, but then Mita went out with a bang. You all embarrassed, scratch your head, and a moment later, doubled over in pain. I feel it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like, genuine respect on that, though. I, I cannot find any links. I tried pirating, like, Adobe Premiere Pro. I just couldn't find anywhere that actually did it legit. Like, genuine respect for actually being able to, like, find it legit like place <laughs> when I with a bang but how on earth did she end up getting injured like this it would take a really long time to explain the one thing I can say is that she came empty even though she pushed herself that hard now <laughs> I risked my life and I couldn't even get one point oh my god she got she didn't even score a point holy shit I was under the impression like Mion had really, I don't know, just dominated the game, but no. Our secret plan did nothing and now we're very sad. I couldn't even imagine what sort of pl secret plan it was, but it must have been crazy enough to get that her that badly hurt. Still though, we're playing baseball as he failing, right? Uh, yep, maybe me chance the last um, resort wasn't very baseball like, I think. <laughs> I think kind of It's actually going to be really interesting. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, I, I definitely need to check that out. You might have just saved my wallet, basically. Ah, <laughs> uh, welcome back, Ro. Did you have Dorito chips for lunch? Dinner or... Of course it's dinner. <laughs> we have no other resource now, do we? It means that we need to settle the score front and centre in a match befitting a baseball game. Ah, oh, of course, yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, you should. Oh, I gotta, I gotta actually, 
Wait, what? Oh, you can no. skip text with enter? I never realized that. Yeah, That's right, we have this edible at like baseball. <laughs> I think normal people would have given up and gone for a frontal attack, but as a member of our club, I wasn't about to accept that so easily. Like baseball? I don't know. If we look at like a baseball, then we can't be picky, can we? Hmm. Ah, it isn't our club's greed after all. <laughs> That's great. We can't be be That's the veggie of our club. Ho, 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 ho. We didn't know. Sabah got a laugh to each other delightfully. It wasn't really a veggie we could brag about, but the best thing um, about our club was that we never rolled over and gave up. <laughs> but all the cameras are watching very closely, so it would be hard to cheat. <laughs> I think they should maybe, like, not talk about cheating in front of a live baseball game. That, let's be real, they're not going to win. It's not going to be possible. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I, I really like the bloodbath one. Wow. <laughs> That's yeah, really cool. I think even the first one looks good, to be fair. <laughs> because I spread her arms wide, indicating the array of reporters in the bleachers. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, Pixar is baby Photoshop for real, though. <laughs> like, you can do... I mean, it is very good, but you can do so much less. She was right. With all those cameramen watching us through those cameras with giant telephoto leaders. Hmm. Oh, I don't know. I mean... Oh my god. <laughs> he doesn't know. <laughs> I mean... I don't know. I think... Is Tennessee a good place? Foul play will be very tough. That's right. That's the bottom note. Everybody's eyes are well on us and we can't be too bold. Ow, ow, ow. I never did think Mijan's ways were very ladylike. Like. Sadako and Nikajan both nodded behind Denno. <laughs> then, let's get out of business. Our team is on one run now. Plus, it's the bottom of the ninth, and we already have two rounds. If this old man's plan is built and run better, we have our bases loaded right about now. Oh, damn. It really did fail. There's no point in amending a failed plan. Oh, uh, and Club never loses heart, always goes into the next one. I think if you want to, Ro, but like, what would you go for, is the question. Sadako said eagerly, trying to tear up Don Cosmion, whose secret plan had failed. Wait, I'm kind of... What is her... What was her secret plan? It's just, yeah, okay. <laughs> oh! I suppose you could, though. Ah, oh, that kind of... I hope you're not going, like, just to see family, because, but because you actually want to sort of go. Because I, I remember I went to Croatia. I didn't really want to go, but because family were there, I did. But then I actually ended up really enjoying, like, the whole place. Something was it easily trying to... Cheer the downcast me on his secret plan had failed. It may have failed, but Satoko still seemed to have another. Satoko, you seem pretty cheerful, which means you've got something up your sleeve, eh? Kids, <gasps> good. Who do you think she is? It's Satoko Chan, you know. Hoto Satoko Chan. That was right. We called her Trap Master Satoko, didn't we? She would ensnare her opponent at the perfect opportunity at the very end. <laughs> Everybody in our club knew that we could never, ever let our girls against Satoko. Damn. I may have taught her, but she's grown up, grown up a lot and doesn't want to stop. <laughs> Sometimes even I'm astonished at how she overcomes such slim um, margins. Uh, true, I think, I think my favourites right now, the Sack Pen Circles one or the Aerial Gleam one. They're, they're really fucking cool. Oh god. That sounds awful. Yeah, I can see that. By the way, me bats next, then Satoko. Oh boy, we were losing by 
um, one point so if we could get the next runner on the pace then the runner after that could hit a big one and end the match and that final battle will start the call <laughs> See, you feel like we can win now, right? I can't imagine what she's got set up, but it's got to be some kind of trap for sure. If I were the opposing pitcher, I'd definitely walk her. There was no point, there was no way Satoko was going to hit a home run, even in my dreams. But if she was going to stand in the batter's box normally without any kind of plan, I can't think of anything else she could do. And the fact that you called me here, I see. I think I know where this is going. It meant that I was a necessary piece of Satoko's trap? Oh, interesting. I I wonder what Satoko will do. Will do. I have a feeling it's going to involve penalties. <laughs> I can't wait to see Satoko's walk off home run either. Bezan is indispensable for this. This is our last time at creating an upset. We cannot fail. It's interesting. She said. Let me just confirm this. Oh, no, I can't be bothered. She said, Zetai ni shippai deki nai. That means we definitely can't worry. Doesn't it? She did say that, didn't she? So, the time is not a chance. Zetai ni shippai deki nai. Yeah. Literal translation. Good translation. <laughs> that should mean we can't worry. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I, I do, so it was just like kind of a funny thing I sort of noticed. Oh, interesting. It's actually very interesting you say that, because we have, um, we have a, we have one of my mum's parents, my mum's, my grandma's sisters lives in like a really sort of rural place, and we, we sort of went through the entirety of Croatia just to get there. It was really fun. Because that rural place is very rural, sure, but like, you meet some very nice people and then next to it there's a really fucking good town. One of the best cake stores I've ever tried was there. Right, no matter no sure. just what's up on, I will give you all from to the gates turn round a victory of all time. No, I see what you mean. Then I explained to myself as Kizan, and you were here for a moment. Sapagor and I had it up in a hidden place and held a briefing that anyone watching could tell was suspicious. <laughs> I wonder what my about San and Hojo were talking about. I pray it's not some crazy trait like the one the president used. Our teammates Tomitaku and Wakamadaku seemed very nervous. And then I gave them a wide smile, trying to dispel their anxiety. It okay, everyone, Sapagor and Kizan will be able to pull this off for us. <laughs> But you guys are against the Kosiyan pitcher. I don't know if Sapagos tries to be nice kid. <laughs> now everybody is going to be silent and watch, but you're going to see an interesting game. <laughs> yeah, he knew everything was about to transpire. <laughs> Look, she was having a hard time stumbling the laughter mumbling up within her. She was so terrifying as an enemy, but so reliable as an ally. Myung waved her hands at the umpire. We've got a pinch hitter. Hi, someone's lucky me on us. Switching out with Maya Barakechi. That's risky. Are you sure he'll be alright? But they don't even know if he's good at baseball. I mean, he did say he hit some bats for practice in the past, but like, they don't 100% know he's good. The umpire turned an uneasy gaze on the pinch hitter who had just jumped in with a golf club. <laughs> don't underestimate his good. No. The members of our club were the only ones winning with wholehearted confidence. It's just the weirdest time to end a sort of half of a day. Interesting. Come on. Come on. Come on. South Coast plan was definitely simple but scrupulous. Oh boy, even though like, the entire situation according to our calculations, the fact that we were losing by one point. Oh, he's losing by one point. I thought he was completely screwed. The fact that I had come late. The fact that Sapagol was the last batter. Even felt like kind of this, like this had been set up before the game had started. I wonder what he's gonna do. There been a lot. <laughs> there been a long time since I got here. And during that time, the yeah, Abazan bitch uh, Kamadaki and took a back bathroom break. Even about calculated. Wait, you beat it? I mean, I mean, okay, okay, like, firstly, that is fucking unreal, I couldn't agree more, but, like, did you beat it? Oh my god. Wow.
<laughs> well, you're very close to. God, that is nuts. Oh my, wow. <laughs> God, I couldn't imagine playing something for that long. God. <laughs> oh. Oh, that is awful. No, I can't understand. I can't stand that when you have like you have something you really want to do in a game and just like your hardware fails you. Because I got that so much with my controllers, like just A buttons becoming really sticky. It was a nightmare. No, this is other we're talking about. So maybe, maybe she gives him a laxative somehow calculated to get him out to use the bathroom at this exact moment. And while he was, it was a long way up. Sat up in the bathroom. A plan would begin. The opposing pitcher, Kamataki, there he was. In front of the <laughs> What the fuck? In front of the horizon point. He thought it was the only natural when he would a grass lot game like this and relax enough to relieve himself without a care in the world. Maybe that's how he wanted to do a bit of a his relaxed day itself was our chance. Right now you've already conceded to our club. <laughs> I too casually walked into the bathroom. There were three come on. Is this? <laughs> I went uh, to the one next to him. Normally you leave the one you want. <laughs> God, I couldn't see the nine just me. I stood right next to him after him. <laughs> Whoa, look who it is. The big pinch hitter. <laughs> he doesn't sound like a high school kid. He recalls seeing me um, as we in the golf club around like an idiot and he couldn't seem to resist the answer love. I uh, wasn't frustrated in the slightest and that's had already won the moment I arrived. <laughs> Wait, so I'm I'm just kind of not really getting this. Why is he in the toilet to begin with? Is this like a break for the round? Oh, they've been a long time out, right. The game had been decided as a big upset for our team. So now all I had to do was push things. I know exactly how Sato got planned. Oh, interesting. I kind of get that with, like, Mario 64 one I so When I used to play them, I used to play, like, levels from hacks that were really, really hated. It's kind of funny that you guys say that. Oh, yeah, I beat Jorobay Tuesday way before. That was a literal nightmare. Did you, like, did you enjoy that level, bro? Ah. Uh, yeah, that's fair. Because you might quit. Ah, uh, right. If you're not feeling it, then yeah, definitely shouldn't. Oh my god, that's the worst. What the fuck? Wow. God, that's... That really... I don't know, it's kind of sad, but... At the same time, it's fucking amazing that people have got, like, that good, you know? But it's just kind of sad for, like, the people who are wanting to sort of become really good. Ah, I'm the one who should be laughing. What's SLH? I wonder if Kitsukun can do it. <laughs> He'll be fine when Kitsukun is serious. He can do this much before. He can do this much before breakfast. Tomitakun and Wakamadakun are underclassmen. Asked another question with more trepidation. Oh, damn. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Funny, funny cheater, man. <laughs> God, I, I can't believe he did that. I mean, just how scummy and just shitty of a thing to, of that to do is just another topic entirely what was slaughterhouse replaced with was it like i don't know firework <laughs> <laughs> oh, is my brother's i'm really going to be able to beat that picture <laughs> <laughs> you don't feel any confidence in kids on after being in the same class with him. <laughs> oh my god. That just really says a lot there. <laughs> oh yeah, of course, yeah. Oh I remember I remember seeing things about that actually. Damn, so that's number one. That's insane. Wow. <laughs> it's insane that like a level seemed as impossible to like everyone has actually been beaten. God, I must take some serious balls to do. God. 
Oh god, I hated that level, bro. Good luck. I, I feel really bad for you. <laughs> Join K-Town and you can easily rule the world. <laughs> the world. <laughs> I think my exchange glasses. Did my bad senpai really have such incredible strength? Just what kind of strength did that be? <laughs> my question was, my question was, come back into I'm staring bewilderment and for a moment he didn't know what to say. Sorry, I don't think I heard you right. Did you say that again? I, I smiled thinly, looked straight ahead and said it one more clue. I'll say it once more time. Let us win. <laughs> right to the point. No threats or beating around the bush or anything. Kamada's brain couldn't figure out what the meaning of what I just said, and clearly, he, I could clearly tell he was confused. What are you, come sign a moron? Let you win? Are you insane? I've, I've relayed our demands. What's your reply? Yes or no? It goes without saying, like, how much let you win? Is your brain broke? <laughs> Kamada didn't hide his bewilderment. He didn't want to be around with someone who would babble on like this for another second. Those thoughts spurred him into his expression and he quickly moved to leave the bathroom. Kamadaki, what does victory mean to you? That's a dumb question. Priceless. Absolute supremacy. Nothing else can change it. You bring value as an answer to Sif to make fun of me. <laughs> it's not like a sportsman to say that. Victory decides no one can change that. <laughs> of course not. No matter what kind of threats or bribes you come to me with, there is nothing valuable enough to make me abandon victory. Wow, God, that is really odd. <laughs> I mean, I don't remember the level much, to be fair. I just remember I really hated it. Wait, Ro, you, you at least hate Theory of Relativity and Tyrian Wall as well. They're some really awful map pack levels. Please tell me you hate them. Please. <laughs> oh, wow. God, that's really cool. Okay, it's probably better that you haven't, but they're just some absolutely terrible map pack levels. <laughs> I was waiting for those words. I, after spinning around with um, three and a half time, pointed right at right Kamada's face. Then, why don't you think you should ask something worth running your previous victory for? What kind of conversation did you be given? Oh, interesting. What are you saying? Stupid, there's nothing. Nothing that can make you do that. <laughs> he was definitely denying it, but he stopped. He stopped. He was waiting. He was waiting for me to present some attractive conditions. In a magazine interview, you said your famous views were all grilled meat and you didn't like sweets. But you lied about that, didn't you? What, what? For example, let's say you read the grilled meat buffet. What exactly would be on your plate? Pork loin, green what the fuck is that? I wouldn't be here. You wouldn't bring me with you. It would be all the pudding and the gelatin cake you could eat. The puns would go with. Oh, God. Love wasn't true, darling. I'm sorry. Kamada's face turned out really pale. Our club already knew that he ate a mountain of desserts when he met to the group meat buffet, and we were well aware of his embarrassment at his weakness for sweets despite his age. Kamada Kun couldn't possibly have known that the particular group meat buffet chain in Shizibone was owned by a member of the Sonazaki family. Oh, that's the worst. <laughs> I don't even know. It's it's some um, insane pack, but I'm not entirely sure. I can I can tell you the level names like spelt out if you want to. I have to be careful when I go out to meet with my parents for now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, no, I love the hearty bony. No, really like his gender. Don't tell me. Don't tell me this dude is actually going to sexualize liking eating desserts. Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> What's the other one? Yata's easy than... Yata Garasu is like easier than Sonic Wave, isn't it? So I guess it's off. But I don't know. God, if it's off, that's kind of sad. Oh my god. God, that is so... Just... Low. Wow. Isn't it 
無垢な汚れを知らぬ少女を演奏させる。君だらけの欲望、私のスポーツ光が。怪我するように、バリバリとむしゃむしゃと。Oh my god. I can't tell who's less mentally okay. Katie for actually like convincing him that this is the case, or Kamada for like thinking this. But how does Katie know? That's right, you read this as the video, but you don't love them. You just don't l o v e Oh god. All you do is read as you enjoy them. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, please don't want my secret, my secret pleasure has been found out. I can't go on living. I have to, I have to die. <laughs> you really don't know who you are. So easily. But why is it so normal to be a complete, like, messed up person in this game? I swear to God. Because slam, I hit him on the side of his head as hard as I could. Damn. Kamada fell like fell down like a girl's ass type of walk during any breakdown. <laughs> I'm probably the only one in the world who thinks he's up. These things are reading the sense. Oh, I can I can certainly tell you that I don't. You know, I think of when eating desserts. I think, oh, this tastes really good. Or, oh my god, this sauce is really good. Not. I'm not even gonna say what he's thinking because it's so. Yeah. I mean, he kind of he kind of summed that up. I can't lie. <laughs> That's right, you're a pervert. <laughs> Could you imagine just like anybody in the bathroom that's like near them? <laughs> just hearing these screams. Bushwee! That is the best sound effect. This time I didn't hit him, instead I clapped my hands down onto his shoulders. Ah, oh, see ya, Trick. Yeah, I really hope you have a good one. And yeah, hope you enjoyed the stream. Do you mind crying, Kamada? What's the. <laughs> I'm actually screenshotting this. This is. <laughs> This is, I, I kind of like, don't think this is true. <laughs> ah yes, ah yes. <laughs> dun dun. Yeah. A man ought to be a person, but admitting it says a man apart from his clothing. You've been honest to yourself, you can brag about that. What kind of logic about is that? What if you've just killed somebody? And then you're like, I killed somebody, I'm a murderer. You're honest to yourself? <laughs> can you, be, you can be arrogant about it, you can be proud of yourself. Instead of blaming him, I told him to have pride in myself, and Kamadaki couldn't hide his confusion. Yes, I have been deeply moved by what you've said. Deserts and nothing. That's what I thought this whole time, but I was mistaken, and you showed me that. Thanks to you, I can stand tonight, I'll be able to enjoy my desserts and Oh, God. For example, strawberry shortcake. I'm gonna search that up. I'm, I mean, I'm assuming it's just some, some sort of cheesecake, but what actually is it? Strawberry shortcake. There we go. Oh, interesting. Right, we're gonna see. We're gonna see like a really banger dessert. We're gonna see my view of it, my reputation, everything just completely flattered of it. Completely flattered? Completely crushed. Yeah, correct word. <laughs> right. Oh, I should probably like move my webcam a little. Correct word. <laughs> right. I should probably like, move my webcam. Bruh. Okay, there we are. <laughs> oh, of course we're in Angel Mall. Strawberry shortcake. God, Gamada's throat. Gamada's throat. Hand out. Uh, Cried out. The simplicity of the strawberry shortcake, indeed, is somehow outmatched by the orthodox maze from the gods. 
I don't know. None of those bloody magic fort skins we have now. Oh, skirt. Oh, God. Another one's green. First of the Stories for toys. Oh, God. I could not prepare any more than this, so you're from the taste. That kind of match, honesty, is unbelievably great. Oh, God. Please give me the taste. It's such a. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! How low are these fucking people? These are already strong with these up. They're sending green decorations to decorate. And he's up looking like this. This is him. <laughs> and he's taking this place with a wrist. Oh my god. Yeah. No, no, it'll be. Huh? <laughs> Sorry, it's funny. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> no more than that. I just couldn't, like, shut the door real quick. <laughs> I have not laughed that much for a long time. I don't really laugh much anymore because there's not really any things in my life that like, make me really laugh these days. But my like, god. <laughs> oh my god. This is this is such a bad thing to be playing. Wait, hang on, there's two audio outputs. Didn't realize that. Come on. Weird. Right. Save is meta. And you let your hand cool. Oh no! Oh, what kind of taste was that happy? Oh, the dead puppy you hate the strawberry. I can't hold it in anymore. I'm going to wait for more on the way home and get it. The girl's dressed up here because it's just for me. Just for you? Hmm. I'd rather play with the trembling man than that. I hate this voice acting. I mean, it's like kind of good, but just what the fuck? For everyone I eat, my drop out this way. I praise the goods, wondering who to. <laughs> Please dress like girls, just keep. <laughs> <laughs> Giskin seems to be talking about combination platters. Emphasis mine. <laughs> As if you're seeing each one. I'll hold my jaw tight like this and go. Oh god, has there ever been a man such as this? He could speak so passionately about a piece of strawberry shortcake. No, there's been no. There has never been, I say, such passionate feelings are trying to melt away the stubbornness in Kamada's mind. <laughs> Kamada, I'll say it one more time. Let us win. Um, but, but that would. That's fine. I won't lie on you, I bet you did come and don't out my hill. And I've lost this game, it's over, I don't care about it anymore. It's dead once this game is over, why don't I head down to Wayne anymore and get you all you can eat in one of those? No. Oh god. <laughs> Tonight would be the greatest beast I have ever known, but all you can eat. <laughs> so, that's why this being the bathroom coming up at both of his floors on the floor. Uh, uh, I was wrong. What's wrong, Kamadaki? If you have something to say, then say it. This is this is the first time I met somebody, someone like you. Until then, I've, I thought somebody was wrong with me, and I have to run fun and secretly. What are you waiting for, you tiny man? I already said a minute to your presentation. Is, what? Separate the from the man. You are a man entitled to your pride. Now reach out your hands. Show me how rich you really are. Oh my God! Come me and accept. That it is all well. Uh, <laughs> Clap, Kamadakun was trying. Kids of gratitude, unable to speak. That was the moment we exchanged the most zealous handshake the world has ever known. <laughs> the handshake with the bond of our souls, ardent and intense, tight and steadfast. For a long time, we were aimed that way. It was an enthusiastic handshake, as though we were two brothers separated at birth, embracing each other tightly as though it would give us back the time we had spent apart. 
quite interesting. That was the moment we, that was the moment the man who would pass into the legend for eating so much during Adrian was well, you can eat dessert day that he was banned from the restaurant forever more was born. <laughs> he would eventually write his autobiography that I'm meeting this day was fate. Oh my god. Goodbye to Katie's reputation if that happens. Because <laughs> he'd probably be at a workplace if he actually wrote an autobiography at this time and then just the people at the workplace see that. Eek. But none of that had anything to do with this. Then, until later, for now, just blend it in the way I described it. With that, I, um, I don't... I don't know my hero or maid to leave the bathroom, but then Kamadaki didn't stop me. But wait, at least tell me your name. Who, me? My name is Maya Balakitichi. No, I kind of didn't feel like using my real name. Anyway, maybe I should lie to him and use a code name. Just call me K. 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 That was actually an embarrassing name. I left the bathroom behind me at a quick pace, hiding my embarrassment, but from what I heard later, that I apparently looked quite gallant coming out from... And coming out like that. <laughs> so I have a goal to Kate's song. How did things go? Katie did not have a negotiation successful. We, um, we settled on he and I um, getting all you can eat dessert at Angel Moore. Oh my god, yo, Memphis. Are you are you the person I'm um, thinking you are? Yeah. How's it going? Meow. No, no problem, right? Oh, nice one. Yeah, that's really good to see you here. Yeah, just playing some, you know, um, when they cry visual novel. Such a cool thing to end the night with, man. <laughs> How's it going for you? Is everything going good? Do you guess for Angel Wars or you can eat dessert? Roger that. I'll set it up. <laughs> I'm actually quite interested in how he negotiated with him. They really had a fun talk about how delicious dessert is. <laughs> probably, probably. <laughs> yep. She kind of got the picture. After that, the game started again. I entered the batter's box in a pinch hitter in place of mule. Oh, that's really good to hear. Wow, GG's on that. I mean, I've been doing I've been doing quite a lot tonight. I've been doing like, you know, just learning sound design and doing Japanese. That's been my day really, and the obvious exercise after school. <laughs> I'm actually really starting to get far on sound design. I think I'm really starting to understand it which is just like it's so difficult i swear but after all these pieces were already in place vroom, the straight up pitch whipped by me like a bullet true to its name what happens the camera people raise their voices in wonder and click their shutters a sharp pitch is always he's really going places this summer isn't he oh my god anything's better than mario 64. <laughs> It is actually interesting when you actually play like a lot of the ROM hacks that are just really renowned for being so difficult. You realize how much, just how terrible they are. I mean, look at, I, I know generic example here, but like look at DE, look at anything in that. It's just really, really not good. Is that my voice? That's funny. <laughs> I couldn't even hear myself, but my stream was playing in the background. Yeah, exactly. It's not for the half of the sake of people actually being creative. Yeah. My golf club pinch hitter was standing straight up too. Hee <laughs> hee. But doesn't Kamadaku look a little strange? <laughs> it's like he's got a cold sweat. I'm out of my shoulders with my bat and then snitter him in a relaxed choice. What's wrong, Kamadaku? Not feeling well today? <laughs> oh my god. It's the man himself. <laughs> I couldn't swing at the ball because I was too busy laughing at it. Was that what you got? <laughs> Great, you little. <laughs> Boom. The next pitch was with the same incredible speed as before. It curved sharply and should have thrown off the batter's skill. But then Katie didn't move at all. He just watched coolly. You don't need to watch. You don't need any little tricks on a straight pitch. Come with that Do people go with those curves a lot? Batters around here, that is. <laughs> <laughs> Both the brothers and the people watching noticed something was strange here. Was um, Oshima's, um, Oshima's Kamada, the pitcher who combat Kosien, losing the mental battle? 
The next strike pitched incredible speed again, but it went a little wild. It was a ball. I snorted, not even bothering to get ready for it. Walk on the back in, scared of going right down the middle. <laughs> Everybody calls you the best, you never walk the bat. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> my, 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 the normal, unexpected situation spread confusion throughout the reporters. <laughs> what, what, what is he? Who's that man? I'm going to be so nice to face with the extreme fastball. <laughs> He's just bluffing. He knows he can't win. Kamadon would never throw a ball with that, that an insincere guy couldn't hit. No, I don't think it's a bluff. I think they say at a high level you can do right through others. Fair, high level of manipulation here. <laughs> Kamadon is, well, without a doubt, one of the best. Which must mean he can see that mysterious man's true value. A really business person looking guy took off his sunglasses and gazed upon Katie. Huh? Huh? Is this... Could it be the idiot pinch hitter who came in cheering them with a golf club was actually a genius? <laughs> I'm sure a baseball has gone long since. Um, as long as it's lost his chance for him, and now he's trying to switch over to golf. <laughs> a genius slugger making a transfer into the golf world. <laughs> what a tremendous loss for baseball. Stop the presses. We're going up the sports comms. Wait, hang on. So, has he hit all these balls? Hit all these balls with a golf bat? Holy fuck, that's actually kind of insane. <laughs> We're taking up our sports columns. Vroom. Boom. Now it's a full count. Ma -ma 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 -ma. <laughs> this extensive production was, of course, all being dramatized by Stafford. The big shots constantly had their eyes on Kamadaki. If he were to lose easily, they knew the match would have to be fixed. Perhaps he wanted this little player past to create mood in where it wouldn't be strange to a Kamadaku to lose, but. Capricorn, isn't this going too far? <laughs> oh, do your best now, get some. Today, this game, tomorrow, all of baseball. I don't want any scouts actually coming after me. I'm terrified of what would happen when the jig is up. Wait, I can't be making nervous faces right now. Oh, yeah, he's got it. He's got to show us he has balls. Ball. Base on balls. Have you gotten scared, Kamadaku? I thought you were better than this. Kamadaku can hold his head in, in fine dejection. Yes, I did this in recording for the final! <gasps> oh. Yeah, well done, Kamadaki. Keep going like this with the next battle. Let's wrap this thing up and then... <laughs> oh my god, Grin, Kamadaki and then I exchanged evil smiles. <laughs> for some reason, there were a lot of camera prizes right then. It seemed like our dear journalist friends took it us two weather while well, smiling to acknowledge each other's strengths. As I trotted over to the first base, the camera flashes continued almost up, almost to the point where they were annoying. When I got to the first base, one of the reporters came over for an interview. My Baraku, do you plan on setting in the scene? Setting the score with Kamabaku in Korsian? Ah, uh, things seem like they were about to go too big for me. Maybe I should just be honest and confess I'm not really into baseball. Korsian, I've never been interested in Japanese baseball, sorry. Ah, oh, okay, wow. This is either gonna go really well or really wrong. Whoa. This man, right from the start, he was almost aiming he was almost aiming for the world. He might become Japan's first ever big leaguer. Um what? Um the conversation was getting fantastically out of hand. Oh I don't care anymore. I'll strike a guts pose for the cameras in desperation. <laughs> yes. Get on gone on base, just as planned. Next Apple Gold Chan is it? Uh, what will she do? Alright then, time to get this walk off home run and win it all. Sadako stepped up to the plate, waving the bat around. The reporters couldn't hold back their laughter, maybe because they had just seen his battle with me. My Badakun finally got on base, but now it's finally over. I see why is this um Kamadaki and so intentionally walked him. Oh. He didn't even fight it. He waited for an easier opponent for the final half. <laughs> Well, it could be that, but no angel what? <laughs> but to avoid a direct confrontation like that was, we cannot make light of it. This is that my brother Katie. All right, come on now, come on, Dasa. You make fun of me. Who do you think I am anyway? Dasa? No, my brother Sam was one thing, but. Um, you think I'll lose the likes of you? <laughs> Whenever this girl stepped out of the back, he, she had swung wildly and missed, striking out every time. This might be, this might sound weird, but however much Kamadaki can hold back, I don't think she'll be able to hit her home run. Oh shit. I can hear the reporters declaring that there was no way a comeback could happen. Hmm. 
Wait, what? Is that the girl? She's showing wildly and missed every single time she stepped out to bat. Boom. Oh, yeah. That, so that was all a diversion. Oh, my God. She swung after the sound attack and completely missed timing it. Oh, I get a disappointed voice is coming from those wooden for Neon Mozilla. It's only natural. Every single battle is struck out. If it, even if worse comes to worst, nobody will get a hit. And that's why I didn't sell strength when Kamadaki said this. I can't take it seriously with someone like you. Sit down. I'll give you a chance. I'll throw in the next one alone. Slow and underhanded. I'll let you get a hit or two so you can go home and brag to mommy. <laughs> of course, these lines were all part of the plot too. From out of the corner of his eye, Kamadaki gave me a look. Ah. Was um that be right? Yeah, you did great. It looked very natural. Come it up, you're a splendid actor. No, compared to Case on, I'm nothing. A <laughs> <laughs> laugh. Even the exchange was seen as a little heated and enthusiastic by the reporters. But Kiss on, I'll have a slowly up pitch can this go really hit it. Don't worry, I'm trying to pull out we plan. I think I've got a good idea of how we'll see down. Our exchange over Kamadakun move from set position into a pitching stance. Oh my god, she's literally chewing a grass piece. No way. Come on then. She's wearing your magical pitch. I'll hit a huge home run off of it. She struck every time um, she was out But When I heard my vague ideas became firm beliefs. And out of Gamadakun's hand comes a slow, lazy pitch as though they were playing cash. Normal people would probably be able to hit it, but for Satoko, who had been striking the whole time, just when people started to think that way, the members of our club had already realised that Satoko's trap had begun. Oh, is he gonna bat it really fucking far now? It was true. Striking out um, constantly today had a bit all been laying the groundwork for this moment. An act. All to make it feel like Kamadakun was letting off the gas, which wasn't strange, it wasn't strange at all. Which, in other words, that Satoko. Oh, <laughs> I knew it. Crack, whoa, she got it. Look at it go. I don't think you need to run, do I? <laughs> the super huge home mom's after got hit disappeared over the roof of the school. <laughs> the reporters left that worse than the sight, and then roars of applause. Despite this being what we'd anticipated, I can't help but stare in a mute amazement at this tormentous home run. And Sadako strutted over to the first base. <laughs> Come on, what are you doing, kid son? Second base is that way. And Sadako, you, you're really good at baseball. And Sadako dreamed of showing her fan-like cannons of reply. Come to think of it, she played a baseball a lot with Domidagun and the others during lunch, didn't she? Um, the fact that they always invited her to play means she was by no means bad at it. And you probably struck out all those times since before Kamadaki even got here. Jeez, you really got some for your case. <laughs> Damn. I say this is the first time, do I not? I do only have one trap, and when everything is about to come to a conclusion, it's enough that I don't even have to worry. Damn. Damn, that sounds kind of cool. Alright, oh, that's clever. <laughs> Basically, she was just bragging about hitting the boat, but when Satoko did it, it looked so cool. We crossed home plate in order, me, then Satoko, and completed our walk off home run. Our teammates welcomed us back with their blessings. My that was amazing, totally cool. I never thought it would happen. Tomitakun on Akamadakun praised me. How about that, Tomitakun on Akamadakun? I turned around things just fine. <laughs> then I think you were cool too. Good work. Hey, there was nothing. I briskly clapped my hand against Nena's outstretched palm. <coughs> Sadako did brilliantly too. She gave us a spectacular ending. Who do you think I am? <laughs> Man, I can't underestimate her. What's your Sadako? Kitan was great too. When in case you come that open like that? Katie, when in case you open was great. He is a magician of words. <laughs> hmm. Uh, I, I don't think that's a compliment, <laughs> but really, only gay song could have um, pulled us a drastic move. I wouldn't have been able to do it myself. I would very much like you to teach me some time. If other girl learns such displays of power, that's terrifying to even imagine. <laughs> I'd prefer if you didn't mimic me. <laughs> After the clone match over, the umpire came to us. Oh, so Edie gets the umpire. Well, whenever you actually want. I'm shocked. He says I'll be able to consider it differently. He didn't believe us at all. The umpire scratched his head apologetically and apologized to Satoko, smiling dryly. <laughs> and Keisuken was amazing too, wasn't he? Keisuken is actually the most reliable person here. 
Well, when I saw him coming in, I got stunned by suddenly how my dance, but a breath of battle against Kamadaki had me on the edge of my seat. Right, that break taking fast. I cried a wise smile. <laughs> Not even the bitter would have been able to realise that while everyone thought this was a fair match, Kamadaki and I were thinking about what evil deserve violating ways. Oh my god. Excuse me, coach. Um, you remember your promise, didn't you, not? Oh yeah, this is, guess I have my choice. <laughs> Ooh. Uh -huh. We did it, we did it, case good, this means we're having a barbecue meat item. <laughs> then I clapped her hands and we all began to dance with joy. Tommy Takuna and the older teammates were jumping up and down too. What's that about? A barbecue meet up? Hey, what an idea is on you? But, they're not going to be able to go to Angel War. Or are they? So it depends, are they going to do it tonight or tomorrow? What are they talking about? <laughs> we made a promise that if we won today's game, he'd treat us to a barbecue party with all kinds of hard class meats. Oh, lucky. I'm so hungry now. It wasn't looking good for a while when Kamadaki even appeared, but as a kid's son, we've won that privilege. I see, so that was it. what this was about. It was certainly not a game where we could have lost. <laughs> yeah. Nia's big wallet would be so sad, so sad. <laughs> You're right about that, but I did make a promise. <laughs> when we eat, we'll do it without any mercy. We need to feel our growling bodies after all. <laughs> Alright, everybody, tomorrow we dine like kings. I mean, they kind of are, to be fair. They did They did win the game. They kind of deserve it. Yeah, all of the members of the Hinamazawa fighters raised their fists high in the air and cheered. Degatan was petting the head of the umpire. <laughs> He was smiling painfully at the off kilt of remarks. He gave her his head and looked like he was about to cry. What? It looks like the price of victory would be pretty big. Oh, oh that's because of his wallet. Oh my god. That is why you don't make bets in public. <laughs> you beat me, but I have no choice since I promised. Guess I should go shopping for some meat. <clears throat> Guys, get some great AB flight, you promised. We won't forgive you if you buy nothing but vegetables to keep it cheap. Boo hoo. The umpire, who they were calling coach, grinned dryly, crestfallen. Umpire? Coach? The uniform he was wearing had Hinamas on our fighters written on it. Oh, so he's not um, the umpire, he was actually one of our, he was actually our team's coach. Oh, my right. My Barakun, is that all right? Can I call you that? Uh, oh yeah, this comeback wouldn't have happened if it weren't for you getting on base. Please come to the Mario Barbecue. Yes! Yeah, Lucky yeah. man! Now was like that, would you please consider joining me in the team? If you were with us, we would dominate the whole prefecture. <laughs> Coach Coach, let's save that aside for now. That feeling went down and literally saved your life. You should be worried about your wallet. <laughs> That's why the Coach being an adult, everybody seems to get along very well with him. Coach, huh? Please, can we make your acquaintance? I'm Iria, the coach of the Hinamizawa fighters. He extended his hand to me. I finally crossed him with my own in reply. I'm Maebara. Nice to meet you. The coach took his other hand and began to strike mine. So, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? 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 So is it like everybody in the baseball game team are pedos? <laughs> <laughs> hey wait, I must really my instruct our mates to take this good care. The skin is on. That's the bad ones. <laughs> Mais, what are you talking about? Uh, <laughs> the ghost eyes were spellbound and his, and his delusions floated through his very own magical universe. He made it supremely satisfied as my hard work at this. Who the hell is this guy? I know. Ah, you look so flustered. <laughs> I guess it's a little strange, but he's really funny, you know, you know? I feel like you couldn't measure him by saying strange or funny. I really didn't know. I really didn't think we'd get along. Snap. The other self in my mind realised that I made a witty retort for some reason. Oh, Come on, settle down already, you're making it sound uncomfortable. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> the ghost didn't try to take his hands on mine until Safa got hit him with a three-fold wash bucket attack, causing him to... Oh my god! Wow, it's a little bit over the top if you ask me. God. That was so fun to read. So now 
the baseball team captain is a literal like sus person. <laughs> oh my god, that was that was so funny. Oh, of course we got like a strawberry shortcake for the achievements, you know, nothing else. Oh, that was so funny though, just like <laughs> I mean, I don't even know, like just all of this. It was so good. Alright, now I'm off. Where to? Look out for cars. Be you. But before dinner time, today was the debut of the barbecue party that was the Hinamazawa Fighters victory celebration. Of course, I have prepared myself sick breakfast in order to stay hungry. Oh, that's smart. Though with the club members coming, it was pretty possible that there would be a contest based on how fast or how much you could eat. <laughs> I'd win that. Hell yeah. Then I was already at our usual meeting place. Uh, Neon arrived a few moments later. Yosha! Great, let's get going. It's all my skips where everyone's starving to death. <laughs> that feeling when great minds think alike. I spent it nothing less. I tell you, when without breakfast, now I'm in top physical condition. Why are you two skipping breakfast? It's bad for you. <laughs> then I make sure to eat something. <laughs> of course. Of course, she cares about her health. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I'll go to bed soon. What? Just shut the door. Shut the door in your room. Yeah, really Breakfast is an important part of the day. Bro, of course. Of course you think that. <laughs> I mean, it's just so funny that she, out of all people, is like the pe the one person that cares about your health. <laughs> oh god, I'm sure that you get that undevelop undevelop mule. Give yourself a... Uh, okay then. There will not happen. There we are. That's that's good. <laughs> if you want to bit of me for them, Kita, then don't give that any sudden ideas. You might start eating breakfast three times a day. <laughs> yeah, because you're not doing that. Yeah, who did this glasses princess think she was going to come for? Well, anyway, we're all nice and hungry. Let's go and drink ourselves at the big barbecue party. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. The venue for the said barbecue was the Huda Dish Ryan Grounds where the Katan lived. They hold events and festivals there and barbecues too. It was a place that held all sorts of ceremonies in Hinamazawa. Come to think of that, there were there was surprised there was supposed to be a big village festival coming up, wasn't there? Oh Watanagasi or something. The scenery you could see from that high up was fairly superb, and the calm atmosphere, particularly to the shrines, was something fairly difficult to find in the city. We left our bicycles at the bottom of the shrine steps and broke into a mad dash up the stairs. <laughs> when we arrived on the shrine grounds, the Hinamas our fighters and their um, fathers had already gathered and had begun setting up for the barbecue early. Of course, Sapago and Ligata were there as well. When they noticed our arrival, they waved to us. Oh, so you managed not to forget about this. Curse as if you were having a meal, there wouldn't have been much more meat for me. Oh my god, how disappointing it is. <laughs> Bro, of course, he's just eating everything. Somehow doesn't surprise me. You are nice around us, but now that we've arrived, you don't think you'll be able to have even one bite of that fabulously marbled beef, do you? Oh my god, I've ate so much today, and yet that makes me feel hungry. Remember when we ate our bento here? You and I have the same difference in reach. I'll be overwhelming you once again. <laughs> what? what? I can't allow that one of my enemies. Crash out all you want, you'll just be watching us feel our mouths with this. <laughs> Don't worry though, we we'll give um, the peppers and onions to you. <laughs> I got Sato got lots and lots of the grilled squash as well. Yeah, just give her the vegetables, no meat. 
<laughs> my sadical heard the word squash her complexion changed colour when she took my overwhelming reach into account she knew it wasn't just a threat it could actually happen <gasps> oh no I'll go tell the coach I'll tell you <gasps> I'll tell you who you really love um, the squash it must be you I bet you'll get the whole mountain of speciality squash all over Japan oh my god <laughs> oh my god so is it the coach <laughs> of course it is Oh my god, of course, of course the coach is a simp, of course. Well, good for you, Sadako, you have your pick up the squash. You can have the squash from dawn to last three meals a day. <laughs> well, I don't know, I don't know, everyone's bullying me. Sadako tried to leave into Denos. <laughs> oh no, clearly given another second, Denos much punches would have had us on the ground. Oh no. So just before Sadako hit Denos, I grabbed her by the nape of her neck and pulled her back. A superb reaction with only seconds of foresight, at least it was supposed to be. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> but then when I got the leaping cry and saw the girl, I looked as if I was keeping her to myself. <laughs> oh, yep. That's it. Bam, bam, bam. No, 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 it's good. <laughs> yeah, Dennis, okay, I'm taking her home. <laughs> oh, I did not saw. Be like me, I'm on this. I like that too. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold up there. Yeah. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Okay, now like a big puppy. There she is. Dennis, I'm over there. <laughs> Just with other girls. Take him. And uh, right away, is that a bringing you guys to home? Me. Me. Sadako, you're me. Oh, look at that. I'm so cute too. I'm gonna do Oh no, she's not gonna beat her up then. Oh, Rika. It sounds you right. And Sadako laughed in a shrill voice at Rika-chan and Dennis. Unprotective game of tag when we watch them sprawled out on the ground. Are you right, right? Man of manners. Sonozaki-san. The coach came over. <laughs> the cage came over and then does a hand something and then that's gonna have to do a little bit of explaining <laughs> yeah this is just how we communicate that's so we don't mind us if the way we communicate ends up leaving bruises on my face then i don't want any more to do with it <laughs> you never learn do you love the coach loudly it made us start to um then I start to laugh too. Sadako's laugh, I think I was yelling, and then our strange voice were kind of comfortable to hear. The sound of life. <laughs> Quite literally as well, you just see a sky. The adults here knew what they were doing, so the barbecue was ready in short order. Our lucky, as the salad oil dripped down onto the plate with a hiss, there was a loud cheer. When the coach brought over the big plate with all the meat on it, we cheered. Uh, again. Whoa, this meat looks amazing. Coach, you really just splurge from <laughs> That is a weird word. <laughs> I didn't make a promise. <laughs> Can you tell how much all of this weighs? It really did cost me a lot. Damn. That really is some, you know, like calculated and badass betting. If I say so myself. Of course it did. That Remy wouldn't be enough of a reward for everything I did yesterday. <laughs> I hate you. They were like the only people that tried, didn't they? Okay, to be fair, Mion tried, but I don't know about like Dena and Dika. <laughs> yeah, Sadako Town's definitely the best of honor today. Yeah, Sadako was the one who hit that last time on afterwards. She might have caught the guy off guard, but the art of flu was so long and true. <laughs> Sadako is pretty, um, pretty athletic. No matter those, you'd be one of the best in our generation. She doesn't fall behind in physical ability, even compared to me. <laughs> Maybe Sato Chan has a big future in the world of sports. <laughs> oh, stop singing my praises, you're making me blush. Munch, munch, munch. <laughs> Sato Kota, whom the excessive plays made her not notice that the moderately grilled meat being stolen one after the other was far, just, was far too cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. My about a song, this is heavy. Probably talking on our camera, that's our boy carrying something over to us. It was a huge barbecue plate. 
Oh my god, lucky. The Bungu protagonist has arrived. The place is chock full of skewers with vegetables and meat on them. The grilled burning hot meat Jesus with the shh voices. They dribbled off. Gulp. <laughs> he needed a lot of heat for cooking something on a metal skewer, so they had grilled the whole plate at once. Yep, can't have a barbecue without some of these. You can say that again. Oh, how else? So let's get it over here. Oh, here you go. <laughs> wow, look, look, it's amazing. Everybody greeted us. Oh, wonder what it is with a cheer. Oh, maybe it's the barbecue plate. Each person received a uh, skill with vegetables and big pieces of meat on it. They also received paper cups filled to the brim with juice. Oh my god, lucky. <laughs> Wait, so, hang on. Oh my god, I'm really tired at the moment. I'm not actually taking in what I'm reading. It's kind of annoying, that. I'm just going to clear my eyes, because... The thing is, I'm really enjoying this. I really want to take it in as much as I can, but I'm just not at the moment. The plate was chock full of skewers with vegetables and meat on them. The grill burning hot meat juice. Oh, damn. All right. Wow. They also received pounds. They also received paper cup for the room juice. In my right hands were pounds of piping hot barbecue. Oh my god. In the left was a couple of juice that I could chuck down. Hmm. I wonder which hand was better. I think I maybe go for, you know, just like the right one, maybe. Hmm. If this didn't make me want to dance, then you weren't a man. <laughs> I can't hold back any longer. I'm gobbling it down. Gobble, 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 gobble. <laughs> Not yet, get on. We've got a little bit of ceremony first. Ceremony? Can I have your attention, everybody? The, clo the coach with a, with a cup of beer in his hand mounted the nearby beer cooler. This is supposed to be a victory celebration after all. We needed an opening statement. Damn, I would end soon. For every second this goes on for, and a little bit more of the food's freshness goes away. No! Start to go um, and stomp down on the back of my foot. <laughs> my word, many ways are so greedy. Can you not make it a little more elegantly? Is everything I'm thinking really showing on my face? <laughs> okay, is everyone listening? We won a huge game late yesterday. It was a hard battle after that amazing pitching game. But thanks to equally well reliable soldiers on our side, we scored a beautiful turnaround victory. To be fair, wasn't maybe the, you know, like, sporty side of the victory, but it was still a fucking victory. <laughs> clap, 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 both my hands were full to the adults and other brothers gave as a round of applause. <laughs> this is to celebrate that victory. As promised, I got a ton of delicious meat for everybody. Get as much as you want and use that energy on our next game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's genius. And then, after a few words of thanks to the fathers and brothers who have them with the barbecue, he then he led us um, in a toast. Cheers. They said that when they were toasting, you would normally down the contents of your top. <laughs> but we were young. At the toast, oh, at the toast, all of us immediately began to dig into our skewers. Ah, oh, lucky. <laughs> After that, I got really loaded with everybody congratulating one another for things they did during the game, like how somebody made a great catch, or how someone awesome looked when stealing a base, or of course, how they, gr they congratulated me too, the saviour who appeared to fight against the costume named Pitcher. Well, well, um, even I did, what I did was all thanks to Satoko. Satoko did have a plan, but you're the only one who could have won over Kamadala. Like you did, Keijan. You did more than enough to deserve praise. By the way, Kate, you went to read Kate with Kamadaku after that? <laughs> Didn't you? <laughs> you look like your best friends. Hmm. I wonder. <laughs> the season of friendship was battled between male rivals or something like that. <laughs> something that I have a feeling, I have a feeling that's maybe like not friendship. Something a little bit more. <laughs> that sort of well is. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> I finally bust through and then I say, oh, she turned red in the face for some reason at the mention of friendship between males dispersing their present seeming ideas. <laughs> Bro, this, this woman literally gets red at everything. Next thing you know, she's going to see like a certain. I don't know, she's going to see. Oh my god, it's the colour purple. 
instant red in the face. <laughs> now then, where's the hero? Or rather, the heroine, Satoko. Oh, there she is. Satoko was with Mikasan in the mood of bragging her heart about another home run yesterday. <laughs> and her teammates sped into no compliment for her, since even though the, he was going on easy on her, the fact that she hit a throw from the Kosien pitcher was something else. Satoko was more loquacious than usual, and it seemed she was in a great mood. She was so she was flying so she was flying so hard that I thought for a moment getting a word in to tease her. Because <laughs> she was the leading actress today, so I decided not to bully her at the moment. <laughs> As I was Satoko going at the things lively as usual under the sun, it struck me that it didn't quite line up with the pleasant time I spent with her. But, but both of those were the real Satoko. I didn't care which it was, but her smiling happy or making a big lively fuss like this, just as long as you would keep, um, keep, keep smiling like this forever. She looked like she had me fun, quite a lot of it. The coach had a me run behind before I realised it. As he gazed Satoko from afar like I had been doing, he addressed me. So I could tell he was talking about her. Oh. Doesn't it close your soul to see Satoko-chan smiling? He, smi he smiled refreshed and searching for confirmation. I felt a little bit embarrassed to admit it, so against my better judgement, I played it off. So, really? I don't think I smile could come <laughs> as much as I played. <laughs> I'm sure Satoko-chan would be mad if she heard that. But part of her is, that, part of her is very cute too. Leaving her goodness aside, I couldn't understand him thanking Sadako for getting angry, for being teased would be funny. Uh, um, Idia. 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 I'd be very happy if you call me coach as well, my brother san As he said that, Coach Idia smiled, blushing a little. Coach, you seem to like Satoko a lot. <laughs> I didn't have any real basis for saying that, it was just when I, what I thought that I felt to be true. That's even worse. <laughs> yes, I do like her. I... Oh, God. He took one turn for the words when she gets older, I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> mm, just thinking a little bit in advance. <laughs> this guy does some really insane stuff, doesn't he? After being astonished by this, I hurried to put my mind back in order. Yeah, this dude's just gonna casually marry, like, how old is he now? He looks like in his 30s. When Satokor's, like, when Satokor's his age, he'll be 60. I think that would be, that would make a lot of sense, totally. <laughs> When would he be? When would Satoko be 30? This was 1983. So Satoko would have been 30 10 years ago. Well, 30 years older, 10 years ago at least. I don't know how old she actually is. She, cause she, so she's in her 50s at the moment. Wait, so... Oh my god, that's really funny. So the people here, if you actually think about it, all of these people here, they're around the same age as like my parents. Oh my god. Let's say Myon, she's like, I don't know, 17 in this probably? So, um, 1966, she was born. Oh my god, that really is close. <laughs> After being astonished by this, I was hurried to put my mind back in order. I heard that this coach guy was the kind of person who said crazy things out of nowhere. Bro, I see what they mean. According to Mion, if I took everything he said seriously, I physically wouldn't be able to take it. If I was able to ignore that part of him, he seemed like he'd actually be a really funny guy. <laughs> uh, my mom did that surprise you? Could it be you're going after Sato 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 that's kind of concerning, I can't lie. <laughs> you can't have competition, man. <laughs> Coach Sadako has never been alive for more than a decade. <laughs> <laughs> Coach Gerber tried, grin and laughed. Is this how I should be doing? I must somehow master the art of responding to this coach guy. <laughs> After that, I received many words of praise for my actions, almost too many. And as that conversation was happening, living inside the confidence of the statements that this coach person would be spitting out suddenly, I learned that he was very composed, not a bad guy by any stretch. Even though he's a little bit sus. 
I'm gonna be well, I think that, I think the sussiness and the insane things and just weird things he says, they should at least be taken into account. <laughs> I think Satoko deserves more praise for that crazy home run she got. I honestly don't think she had a dinner. Satoko's hands over, oh my god, it was more than quite bookworm type. Um, she probably inherited the exact opposite skills to her, her brother. Right, so you mean Satoshi, the one who left Satoko and ran away from home. Satoko's knee and Satoshi Hojo. Did you not know about him? The Satoko Chan's over brother right now. His name is Satoshi Hojo. And he claimed that he was our fighters too. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that's actually really funny. So maybe that's why Satoko was the person to call KT. I wanted him to play a lot more, but then he transferred. Oh, I see. So we transferred. Maybe that was a little more considerate than saying he ran away. Maybe no, they mentioned it. I think it was Dena. I think she said that she transferred too. Oh God. Yeah, I think she did. Oni Kakusin vibes. <laughs> hmm. I don't know the details of him having run away from his home at the time, so I didn't pay much attention to it, but. Only about the transfer. It's sort of unusual. Everybody having fun was far away, and their trouble was existing. The chorus of the cicada separated us from them, giving a, set, a sense of distance. At first, I thought my own voice was too soft for even me to hear, but for a long time, Coach didn't respond to my words. Mm -hmm. So at this point, I began to wonder if I had said something I shouldn't have. Just when I began to feel impatient, Coach finally spoke. Something unfortunate. A few things, actually. After informing me that was what he was about to say, there was a secret. Guys began to talk little at a time. Oh shit. It's been three years already, right around this time of year, I think. Sato-ko-chan's parents were Oh, so his parents... His parents are the ones that... Yes, I probably thought they visited while on vacation. They fell off a viewer staff on. Oh shit. It was supposed to be just a little away from... The house with the family. They went for a walk on the path, um, as you were an age right after it had rained. Alright. Oh, that's awful. There was a little viewing platform that looked like it had a good view, and that was the stage on which the tragedy was set. That metal fixtures in the viewing platform fence had deteriorated from time, and with all the rain they had just gotten, they might have loosened somewhat. Right before Satoko's eyes, both the fence and her parents fell. Oh my god. There was a river within tens of meters below. The water level was high due to the rain and apparently very muddy. Oh no, so did they just get slurred by the river? Your and her parents? And Coach gave a thing but melancholic smile and touched his paper cup to his lips. Without saying anything, I knew how unfortunate the accident was and how Satoko's parents had let been left on an eternal vacation. And then Satoko is, well... I was over to something in everyone's mind that I lost what I was going to say. A single word, orphaned. I knew how little consideration it showed and how much it would hurt Satoko to, without having to say it aloud. Come to think of it, Satoko lived with Nikata and at least and that's what I thought I heard from the others. Wait, Nikata, her father dies from illness too. And her mother soon after. God. I felt like I heard Hurude so, yeah, so Hurude right without any parents, but they brought help by helping each other. Going on, going on without living with the protection of parents is very difficult for kids at that age. Oh god, yeah. Couldn't imagine it. My brother's son, you probably understand that as well. <laughs> but he's 15, he can't even like independently do stuff. Or at least I think he's 15. I've only survived because I rely on my parents, so the only reply I was to not. <laughs> Hurude san is particularly beloved by older people in this village. As long as she's here, she wouldn't. Um, um, she won't want for much. Come to think of it, you're right. Because her aunt kind of seems like the village mascot sometimes. I don't think she'd have such a hard time living here. I think I could go meet just once and get two or three croquets from a vendor after all. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like if she asked for help, everybody in the village would. Oh. But that only advised to Hurude san to take it. Sato ko does it the same way. I think I being so spoiled was just an exception. But I'm thinking anomaly, living on your own as a child should be fraught with difficulty. It wasn't 
very it wasn't then very difficult to imagine how I sat there and sat there and I we just didn't live. It wasn't very difficult to imagine. Was I really thinking that? No, I was only thinking the words. I couldn't imagine it in the slightest. I was about to supposed to imagine it when I saw that annoying smile at first. There was nowhere I could. I found out she was living apart from my brother and I just kind of vaguely thought that it was rather unfortunate. I mean, Sathagol was smiling so energetically every single day. Was I thinking that her smiling meant she wasn't her? That she didn't feel lonely? When she found out my parents were coming home the other night, Sathagol said, a family sitting around the dinner table is the most fun way to enjoy the meal in full. Those words hold a lot more weight. Yeah. I'm seriously considering what to mind. Oh god, I mean, I don't know, I think I think this is genuine and not like the whole omotsukai stuff. Like, genuinely. I mean, he says seriously, so it probably is. God. Oh, adoption? Isn't the secret after one of my coach, but isn't it speaking to his lip? I've lived a really steady life all these years, I have money and a good reputation, but marriage is the one thing I never got around to. By law, obviously, a single woman with dual car. Ah, right. I don't know what it sounds like, I'm a Sadako Chan, I'm an adopted daughter. What a shame. Didn't take long for my dad to get into the community. How about this? <laughs> oh my god, so that's why he was doing it. <laughs> yeah, what? Literally that. <laughs> he does. I first I was only half listening, but midway through I realised how rude that was. <laughs> this coach person seriously only whispered this one girl's half got to be happy. That was neither crazy nor was it nonsense. Yeah. He just wanted her to be happy. Those were his true feelings. Sadako-chan's current lifestyle is probably not a very happy one, but, you know, I want to make it easier for her, even if it's only really a little. Uh, of course, I can't do much for her, but to share my leftover food and do a that so she's probably not strong enough to do. You're wrong, Sadako's happy. Huh? Coach showed me a surprise at having declared that. There are so many people around her that always, really, always really want her to be happy. She can't possibly feel otherwise. I spoke with a serious expression quietly but firmly all the same. It was my approval of his feelings and my gratitude as Sotokol's Nini. Arigato. Hmm. Because we actually think like, he's some sort of older brother to Sotokol. Thank you. Still could have seen, still keep us in room Sotokol Chan, okay? If she, well, if she knew I wanted to adopt her, she'd probably get mad and call me a pair of fools who took me up. Little bit justified, don't you think? <laughs> 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 I wonder if Sadako may have been somewhat childish, but she was still able to emphasize with people. Is he cool in that? I knew it. <laughs> As my feelings had gone across, Coach grinned, satisfied, and returned his grace to the hustle and bustle before us. Hustle and bustle, let's fucking go. Her parents and her older brother, she lost her family, had no relatives, and was huddled up with Ika who was in the same situation. It wouldn't be odd for her to look at her life with despair, but she didn't seem to feel that way. She lived energetically with a smile. I wanted, I want her to keep on smiling forever. It was nice wish, and yet it was um, one that he couldn't help hoping for. So the words that I spoke were the same. What a coincidence! I think the same way. <laughs> yeah, good. If you don't, if you don't think that, then yeah, there's something wrong for you. Oh, you do my about a good? That makes yeah, us friends. Yeah. Let's make a promise. Yeah. A promise? It was a very simple one. The coach said this, giving me a grin. Ooh, that we will never ever make a promise. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's good. It was shortened ah, to the point. Uh, yeah, I promise yeah, too. Mm, coach nodded happily. We exchanged no more words after that. We just sat there comfortably, gave us a good supper, and everybody was having a good time. She suddenly loves family, but there were people watching over her. How reassuring that must have been. Just hypothetically, if you did a dog supper, what would you do? Coach gave him a right happy smile, and then he exaggeratedly tilted it as in contemplation. <laughs> well, first I'll get this cool master. How does the guy always pick the craziest eyes to say the craziest thing? 
Mark あ、ブリティとブリティ似てるよ。日本の詫びさびをミックスしたワイオ接中の言葉なので注意してください。ブリティとブリティ似てるよ。日本の詫びさびをミックスしたワイオ接中の言葉なので注意してください。ブリティと
But then I smile hold her, not blood bloodthirst. <laughs> so it's blocking Sion's way, ready to unleash an ultimate attack if she got within two meters of me. Ah, oh, I felt like this was gonna turn you into a bloody battle. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's too bad. We leave the negotiations for another time. <laughs> you don't have the right to negotiate. Damn. I mean, I, I knew Mion was like really hating of Sion, but like, damn. She is cold. <laughs> Coach, why are you because you're on here too? She's a ghost member. She's been backing off for the last year. Last year. Damn. <laughs> I just thought it would be even cooler with the Sion charm was worth it. Yes, it definitely will be. This is what you planned for all along. <laughs> Mission accomplished. <laughs> hey, get your arm. Come over here. We'll all play the game with strings attached, of course. With strings attached? Hmm. Chan, what about you? The boys are simple and it'll be fun. Oh my god. <laughs> Shut up, I'll just win if I join after all. Oh, I don't want to go ruin my sister's presidential image. Me all now irritated because I'm around with a glare. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what is it? Should I join him to make this battle with the siblings? For your sake, I don't think you should, but if you want to. But bleh. I'm gonna let you play too. Damn. <laughs> well, Mion just avoided a direct conversation. It seems like the twins were completely incompatible with each other. But for real, these people I somehow don't think they get on. <laughs> you were in a plate? I was looking forward to seeing you too, face off. <laughs> I hate Sion. I'm bad against her. Oh, she doesn't want her presidential image destroyed. That's it. And I'm going to be on drive me away. Slide. Do your best. I'll be rooting for you. <laughs> Hold up. I just want to. I just want to take a little break. You know why not? Do your best, I'll be written for you. <laughs> Go for it, Kishan! Yay! Oh. Is your wife behind us revealing in the bliss of the teeling meal? <laughs> All right, competitivities have begun, which meant I needed to clear my mind. Oh boy, here's where the interesting shit starts. What was today's battle, today's punishment game? I take uh, anything on. Sadako, okay, Kishan, you should prepare yourself. We're going all out today. Oh, damn. Great, bring it on, Sadako or not. I'll crash you all mercilessly. <laughs> uh, then I will probably bring my battle and fish yourself up a win. Then I'll get all the Manta Rays first and fight them to victory. <laughs> Oh god, I expected stuff, but I didn't expect that. Oh my god, I want to take you home. <laughs> okay, everybody, we have a lot of people today, so let's play something easy and simple. Today's game is hide and seek. Go on. Bruh, why would you end there? Come on, man. I want to... I, I hope it's hide and seek. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Come on. Come on. Everybody who lost the game dropped out and had to help clean. <laughs> had to help clean up the um, barbecue. Zion <laughs> laughed more uproariously than everybody had ever heard when she saw my face. Okay, okay, it was my getting. Was my getting popped out of the game really that funny? <laughs> oh my kid's on space, he was like, how can you call <laughs> Oh my god, damn it, I, I had it all worked out when I brought up the scissors. What? If I knew Sato, only, if I knew Sato and Nika chan hadn't be betrayed me. Damn, I was, it was going great until we 
but we are maintaining a united front, but Safakon had been quickly to betray me, quicker to, to betray me than I was her. She was just a tiny bit better than me. <laughs> 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 Animously wearing, I told you so faces. <laughs> Incidentally, those two were victims of stuff that caused traps pretty early on as well. <laughs> oh, of course, damn, I was trying. Um, damn, I was trying to do well enough to make up for you two. And um, once again, for the showdown, it didn't matter. Maybe this meant I couldn't. I still couldn't match up to the other members yet. Oh God. <laughs> You're gonna have the lowest ranked member of the club, of the club player punishment game value. <laughs> but it says Sion, she wasn't even in the club. And Sion remarked as though it wasn't made to recall something I'd tried to forget, even for a moment. <laughs> um, is that right? Come to think of it, my battle's arm. When you came up with the punishment game for the president, you looked really heated up. What well, the other on the, Did you decide? Oh no. <laughs> Ali, uh, Mion told me to get an angel. Oh no. <laughs> He's asked for it. Let's be real. <laughs> He's not going to get the biggest, the biggest size. Oh no, Tomodaku no Nakamadaku and Rukuri. Giving me this complex, indescribable look. Makes the empathy pity and the desire to see something scary on the box. <laughs> All I can do now is laugh. Strangely enough, the more I laughed, the more I felt like it was actually funny. <sighs> I lost. It was Alright, I'll be quieter then. I'm... I'll be quieter. Oh my, my little son, what's the matter? You're smiling, crying, and howling. <laughs> it's okay, he's pretending not to. He's <laughs> pretending not to like it. He can hardly say he's opportunity to gain valuable experience. The punishment game is an excuse. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what do you mean, valuable experience? <laughs> hmm, I really wonder. <laughs> I have my eyes on another good name. My state of mind can be summed up with a three letter word. It was sob. Because <laughs> generally, with his hands on my shoulders, will he comforting me? What a weird way to comfort someone. My other side, in times where you must have said, can just imagine that you are made of this evening under some straight dip. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know the situation seems kind of fun now. Fun. <laughs> Red in the face and indulging his imagination, still holding my shoulders. Coach said, oh. Oh god. I had to wonder what kind of worse associations he had going on in his head. At the very least, it was very different to what was in mine. The first thing that came into my head when I think of disciplining certainly is a maid. Bro, I think it's I think it's like head teacher or like teacher or something like that. Oh my god, that's so funny. <laughs> I think this dude, he really just has like a wrong idea of life. <laughs> Tomitaku, Okamadaku, your coach is pretty funny. <laughs> I'm surprised he can even be a coach. <laughs> they both exchanged glasses and answered with dry smiles. And they just said something that he was a really nice person most of the time, which is something you'd normally say about a person like that. <laughs> the coach's questionable revolution stuff and slowed to a stop, and then his expression returned to a clear calm one, almost making what had just happened seem like illusion. <laughs> Of course. Nothing happened. Nothing happened here. Everything 
is fine. <laughs> you can switch gears way too fast. <laughs> then another start cleaning up. My bad, son. You seem quite strong because you bring the place over to the boss bases and clean them. Right on it. I hosted the difficulty. I ho I hosted the dirty barbecue plates, each with slamming oil plumbing to it, and looked for the wash basins. Ah, oh, these are heavy. Where where are all the wash basins over there? And figuring I should um, make it over there before my arms gave out, I headed towards it in a, at a trot. A lot, of the, a lot of the adults who had been helping out there were using the wash basin, so I gave up and looked for a different set. I asked them, and they told me they were more right by the assembly hall, too, so I decided to head that way. Oh, wow. This is an interesting little building. I've never really seen this before. Oh, I know, I think I have, but, like, not recently, at least. Rather than multiple basins, there was just one faucet here. I initially thought it would be too small to wash plates as big as these, but I thought... It, but it would probably be still faster than waiting for a faucet to open back up for. I turned the faucet and water much less looking than it gushed for. I put a plate under the faucet and, and scrubbed it with my hand to try and rub it clean. Oh, right, so he's just cleaning, like, I don't know what he's cleaning, he's cleaning something. It didn't go very well. <laughs> you go with a sponge and a dish. You, can, you can't wash him with just water. <coughs> <laughs> oh my god, of course, Sion. <laughs> Sion being like the most helpful person she can. Let's go. It was Sion. It was you threw a brand new sponge and container filled with a cleaner to me. Damn. Oh, Try you. hard. <laughs> oh, thanks. You should have just put them by the basins and left it to the grown ups. <laughs> You're always doing the right thing. I got the feeling that wasn't quite a compliment. I answered her with a forced smile. I was surprised to learn you're the manager for the Hinamazawa fighters. And I was like, it's like a compliment, and yet it's really not a compliment at the same time. <laughs> I thought you can do stuff like that because it's too much of a bother. Yes, it is quite a bother. That's why I've stopped doing it during half entirely. You should pay a visit to once in a while. <laughs> no, I don't ever feel like it, I guess. This will make it sound like the end of the world could happen if she's before she felt like it. Whoops, I couldn't keep watching the dishes while preoccupied with conversation, so I decided to take my task seriously. She won't neither offered to help nor got in my way. She just quietly lost the water flowing from the faucet. <laughs> Alright, I heard something. You were the star player in yesterday's game, weren't you? So I thought I the home run, so I think she was the real star player. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Just, you know, just like self-deprecation well not really self-deprecation but just all the attention the spotlight get off me i didn't know she had those kind of reflexes they surprised me she's totally different from sato skin that's how i started the, all the athletic ability and the family went to her and she all smiled as she spoke her eyes looking at something far away betraying her resentment um, um, reminiscence sato sato's older brother Do you know sato skin Oh, right. You just moved here this year, didn't you, Kitan? You wouldn't have ever met him. I was a little surprised that Sion knew about Satoshi. Never about him, but I knew, I knew, I knew, a, I knew a little. After their parents passed away, he transferred to a different school, right? I would have said that he ran away from home and used the slightly more vague words that everyone else did. Interesting. Transferred? He said anything like that? Oh, God. I hadn't realised that Sion's tone had changed slightly. Oh, God. Oh. Well, I mean, this is just like a little bit intimidating. Let's just say that. Well, I mean, who was it then? Yeah, I heard it from someone that he transferred. He said that because he was somebody, right? I don't really remember. He didn't say we transferred. That's it, right? I thought there's a problem with it. Does that mean there's a record of his transfer? Right, yeah. Interesting. To another school. And uh, somebody you saw? Or heard about it? Around that time, I not only noticed how awfully caught up on this scene was, but how startlingly dangerous her eyes had begun to do. Oh shit. What's up? You look really serious. Without Sion, seemed to realize the expression she was making. 
She took a deep breath, pretended to fix her hair, and went back to a composed expression from before. I'm sorry, but Kitan, you don't know much about that skin, so please don't say that you transferred or, some, or anything like that. Oh, I'm serious, please. God, I realise I must have said something I shouldn't have. But when I immediately, um, well, I wasn't immediately sure of what I said, but I apologise for, so I just said it one, say well now, sorry. I just sort of heard it transferred and believed it. Was it actually something else? Oh, God. It was actually something else. President preceded by his parents, he had left his sister and ran away, but I wanted to try and avoid using the words ran away, so I probably didn't want to know. Upon seeing my flash of red eyes, she realised that she was intimidating me and lowered her voice. Oh, interesting. Uh すみません。別に経験を詰めてるだけじゃちょっと言葉が。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。あ、ちょっと。
It must get boring, but like, still, there's so many things you could do. Anyways, I'm looking forward to for Kid Sans Punishment <laughs> game. <laughs> However, um, in Kenny really implements such a thing, I would think the store manager would have a thing to do to say about it, no? <laughs> oh my god, a baby kid's game would be really cute. <laughs> I can't even see it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the edge of my seat, I'll jump in on the floor. <laughs> oh my god, that would be great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why can't I win now of all times? Whenever I think I'll definitely win today. <laughs> and that, I made somebody else play the punishment game at least. <laughs> Is it not allowed to do I believe? I had enough of it today. <laughs> The wailing even. <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait for this. This is gonna be so funny. That's a puff. <laughs> this is like a strong risk. <laughs> this is like a strong risk. It's like I'm looking at Mita from last year. Oh god. Oh, she probably will like the, you know, the funny. <laughs> so. This is how you get stronger, guys. Wear angel more uniforms. Makes sense. <laughs> Me on last year. What, did you always lose a mode about it in the past? However, very, how oh, very interesting. I didn't know how undefeated President Myung was once like that. Hmm. <laughs> He's talking about it. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe Casey has potential then. Of course he does, but like still. He needs to talk about that. Myung hastily covered in his mouth. Everybody watched. But everybody watching burst out laughing. <laughs> Finally, because I'm putting on Sakatoko's sleeve. Okay, we should be going soon. Oh, let's go shopping for dinner, dinner mustn't we? I wanted to keep it talking like this forever, but it was getting late. We split up with Sakatoko when he got on and decided to get on our way home. <laughs> Alright, bye. See you tomorrow at school. Everybody waved to see each other and put and split up for the short time between now and tomorrow. Oh my god, come on, when's the punish wave? Okay, let's go. We've become walking down to a case leading from the shrine grounds. Oh my god, punishment game, punishment game, punishment game. After the sun started to head, the, the afternoon's heat began to disappear as though it were never there. Just listening to it, the chorus of the Higurashi was enough to make me forget about how hot it had been today. Oh, so it's like a proper um, summer's day. Damn, come to think of it, it's still June, right? We didn't have a rainy season at all this year, like all of us up it's just summer, you know? Bro, that's kind of relatable. <laughs> We're kind of getting that here. Now that I thought about it, she was right. It was June, the season of a long rain, and hydrangeas and snails. Oh, is that like a insect or something? Interesting. I hadn't seen a real rainy season since transferring here. Damn. <laughs> according, to the, um, according to the weather forecast, it's supposed to get more rainy during the first part of the week. Oh, they were warning people about heavy showers. I hope it doesn't run into battle like us. Oh my god. Oh, stuff like that is a nightmare. Like, just the fear of rain. That's right. The rainy season is supposed to be rainy. Lena likes all the rain in the rainy season. <laughs> of course, Lena likes the rain. Of course, she does. That just really doesn't surprise me in the slightest. What's my friend just made me depressed? <laughs> but that too, bro. Hey, get on. Oh, oh. I was a little space out, so I was late and answering meal. I was thinking about, I was thinking about my conversation with her sister. And I said that after she transferred, she clearly got angry. She was mad at me for saying something so careless. I mean, it may have been a vague way of skirting around the fact that he has run away from home, but I don't think it was so bad that Sion would need to feel mad about it. I wasn't really satisfied with it. I felt like a child completely ignorant of what he was being scolded for. So many thoughts spilled in my mouth. Out of my mouth? Oh, fuck. In a very direct fashion. Shit. Satoko had a brother, right? Name Satoshi, I think. Eh? What? As soon as I mentioned the name Satoshi, and then I'm young, and both lost their relaxed and comfortable mood as made strange expressions. Should I have avoided talking about this? That's what that made me think. But I already said it, so that's that. And I'd be lying if I said I wasn't Satoshi interested. What happened to Satoshi again? Did he move away? And there was such a transparent way of... That was such a transparent way of putting it, but in my desire to know everything, I find it in Um... Mm. Mm. Myung turned around and looked um, to Denon for assistance. And then I looked between us and then quietly and softly spoke. Wait, did we not tell you? He transferred up. Oh, interesting. 
when I saw this was this young, she got upset. Someone else said I would do the same way. Someone gave me transfer. Who told you something? Who told you something? Oh, interesting. Hmm? Um, I only intended to bother if she wants words, but it had exactly the same way. Uh, it, I said it exactly the same way she had. Right down from the thorns in my voice. When I realized what I had done, I immediately tried to stop my... My mom, if you really transferred, there would be records of it at school and stuff, right? But there... But is there anything like that? No, not that no. Their eyes grew wide. They were at a loss for words. I started to feel like I was doing something really bad. I thought they were only hiding the fact that Sathokos had longer brother run away out of consideration for her. I'm not trying to blame you for anything, okay? I just wanted to ask you what happened to Sathokos after all. I wasn't trying to blame you. The fact that... I had to remind them, even though... Even though... Like I was tormenting them with an impossible question. Now maybe I was actually bullying them. <laughs> maybe I'd lost out on them in retaliation for Sion getting mad for me. This whole day had been so much fun, but now, why did I go and say something that made all of that meaningless? I couldn't help but regret my own careless curiosity. That's enough. Let's drop it now. As I was about to say that, Mion spoke up. Um, well, it's not like we were hiding it online, I hope you understand, that's not what we were trying to do, Mio was telling me to convey her genuine awkwardness. Oh, interesting. It sounded like the excuses of a child who had been presented with evidence of our own mischief. <laughs> Start to see if, well, he didn't transfer school. Um, Mio said, resigning herself, but I felt bad for, punish for pushing her to say that, so it's okay. Mio, let's stop talking about Satoshi. Sorry for teasing you, I wanted to apologize, but right before that. He won't come back? God. Eh. What? I like Mio's stamina of lying with Enos was extremely clear and resolute. He won't come back. Eh? Why? He won't come back. Ever. He won't come back home ever since that day. He won't come back. That was a very strange way of putting it. Normally you would say he hadn't or come back yet. Oh god, at least I thought you could only say that. You'd only say that, then I did if he wasn't capable of coming back. You didn't say that. <laughs> you not say like that when talking about somebody who had run away from home. What do you mean you won't come back? Where does go? Don't know. Oh god. Don't <sighs> Oh, that is cold. Nana's word choice felt very cold for me. It was so cold that I couldn't even muster his voice right away. Well, see, right. After that day, Satoshi hasn't returned to home. Mio manages the deadlock between us and hurriedly followed up on what Nana had said. Well, that is everybody in the village search for him, and we even got the police to help us. Look, well, we started thinking that maybe he ran away. Interesting. They started thinking maybe he ran away. When running away from home, I thought he was supposed to leave a note or something. So when Tatosi ran away, um, he probably would have just left some kind of a letter apologizing to Zabako. That was kind of what I figured. But from the way Mion was talking, it seemed a little different than just running away from home.名古屋駅だかで、佐藤氏によく似た人が目撃されたとかで。私はそんなの。佐藤氏が家出なんかしてるのに、家出なんかしてるのに、家出なんかしてるのに、家出なんかしてるのに、家出なんかしてるのに、
Oh my god. Bro, that was so terrifying because I didn't see, like, um, Nano's eyes. And when I just saw them, they actually really scared me. And all you also I wouldn't allow that. I said, stop it. おやしろ様は雛見沢の守り神様。うん。おやしろ様は絶対に許さない。私は捨てる。I <笑> The police may have said he ran away, but I don't believe it. I won't believe it. Not ever. It's just like I'm going to say something about the police. That's true. And whether or not you want to believe it, I'm going to say it's... Wow. You want to start running around the head? Fuck. Not in a dragon way either. Shit. I told you to get me arrested. I tried to be nice, but you're pushing me to my limits. Pushing her to her limits actually there was plenty of displeasure and anger on Neon's face at the moment. God, for a few months after being here, it kind of looked astonished. Perhaps the voices of the Higurashi qualm that Frank didn't mind, because after a little while she regained her original calm expression. Oh, good. Oh, God. Oh. We arrived at the place we always split up with Neon. Nobody said a word until we got it. Oh, fuck. God, this really must have caused stuff. The voices of the Higurashi just tortured our race with their passing. <laughs> dot, 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 dot. We always split up with Neon here. They were just in on me. Didn't I promise you to lend some manga? You wanna come over real quick? Huh? She promised that? However, I quickly realized it was a convenient way of saying she wanted to talk to me alone. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay, then. Nena was going home. Maybe she realized it, maybe she didn't. Thankfully, then I'll quickly say she'd go home before us. Okay, then I'll. Bye. See you tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Kids can. Don't need too much of a bother. It's already evening. I'm just gonna borrow a few books. See ya. Instead of in the fun day we had, it was a very. Um. Um. It's a bit lonely party. Hey, don't worry too much about before. After a little while, Mion finally spoke. Wasn't time to pass since splitting up with him. No, I'm not really. I think it was my fault anyway. We weren't trying to hold, hide anything about Satoshi. It's just one of those things that we should mention. Yeah. At this point, I understood exactly what she meant by that. It doesn't matter how cold interaction with Denon, I understood so well with her that I shouldn't ever talk about it again. Oh, God. Actually, if that's the case, we're with Sion, too. No, this is a bigger problem. Talking about it in the first place has been indiscreet. I shouldn't have been interested at all. But that's why I really have to think about it. About why everyone got so irritated. Idiots took this one out of Katie. By the time I tried to warn myself, I had accidentally spoken with me. I won't so again, so could you tell me honestly what I know happened to Satoshi? You're running away, right? Oh, God. For a long time, Mion remained smiling, but finally, unable to endure it any longer, she began to speak timidly. Have you ever heard of Oyasuro Sama's Tatari? Mm, curse, even. Um, just a little bit. I got the gist of it. I only ever heard somebody in class talking about it, though. Oyasuro Sama was the name of the deity for technically you know, Hinamizawa that they worshipped at the shrine we had the barbecue at today. And a few years ago, and a few years ago, when they started talking about the flooding, you know, it was as part of the dumb project. One of the people worked on site died or something, and people blamed it on the Yasuda Sama's curse. That's how it was. Satoshi's dead parents, they were um, proponents of the dam project. Oh, yeah? uh, wasn't there anyone in the village against it? Why would they support the project even if they lived there? And the dam project, they would flood the entirety of Hinamizawa. I heard that the village got we got together to fight the terrible project, but it was a little hard to believe that there were villagers who were supporting it. Wait. Oh my god, so that's what happened to the people that were supporting it? Fucking hell. Well, there were a lot of stuff. There was a lot of stuff going on. But not everyone agreed to sign up for the damn proposal. Sotos' parents were basically the leaders of those who were confident. Oh. The leaders of the ones were... Oh. The leaders of the ones were... In other words, Satoko and um, Satoshi's parents? Yeah, the government had gathered a little bit of conversation and managed the exchange of 
her construction of the dam. There were plenty of people who agreed with the proposal because they wanted the money. Oh God! Aside from a few households, you know, the one was in general not very affluent. Um, not because they were planning to inherit the land of their ancestors. It wouldn't be a stranger if some people um, wanted enough money to start a new life. But even in that situation, even in that case, they would have to hesitate to say so, given the situation. It just happened to be the South Korean and um, South Sea's parents who understood that, understood that, and uh, turned out to be their relatives. The last time you may say South Korean and South Sea's parents were very heroic. They volunteered to be hated. Um, and to help those without much money who didn't have a voice. And then the parents got bad enough. They died in an accident on the day of the festival honoring Oyasuro-sama. So it could have started to think that maybe it might have been Oyasuro-sama's curse. Um, I thought, in fact, what the coach told me today, they went to a nature park on a family outing and fell from a cliff. So people thought even Satoshi wanted away from home was because of Oyasuro Sama's curse. Well, hmm. 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 Well, it was a bit of an evasive reply, but I felt it was wrong to ask any further, so I didn't press her for details. I don't think I need to explain this, but, um, the father of her, her parents accident and Satoshi ran away, and all the business of our Oyasuro-sama's curse, none of us are very happy story, you know. Yeah, of course I knew, I could only not sign it, no. That's why we're not mentioning Even if somebody else about Sato transfer schools. Oh, right. Interesting. Yeah, I think I think it's really good of them to like not mention about her family because I think unless she actually openly wants to talk about it, it's not a good thing to, you know. You can understand why we they wanted to protect Sadako's happiness as well, as somebody who thought that way once, even for a short time. I really did regret having been imprudent enough to approach the subject of Was he a or small? Seeing a little bit relieved when, without understanding, thinking that I should get going, I began to make my way home. I could really help stop by. I could really have stopped by Mio's house, but it was already late. I stopped by. Again, the next time. Well, then, Mio, sorry about the day. See you tomorrow. Yeah, goodbye. Wave to each other. And suddenly, my memory is something Mio called out to me. Get out. One more thing. Not only about Sadako, it's a few times about Satoshi with Lena, too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Huh. No, I think you realized earlier, but for some reason, when it comes to Oyasuro-sama's curse, she gets extremely serious. Ever since she transferred here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just by how Dana was acting earlier, there was clearly no laughing matter to her. Mion had underwrapped a bit of conversation with us. But if Mion hadn't been here, what might have happened? Why was Dana being so serious about it? Not only Dana, but Sion too. Yeah. I don't know if Dana is. Oh, this is a secret. If we don't anyone, we're not friends anymore. Damn. You won't emphasize this as her expression. Clouded even further. What's this about Dena? She says she's been a victim of Oyasura Sama's curse, but I don't know. I don't know what I mean, but I think it might be bad because of the producing complex or some kind of persecution complex or some kind of wrong assumption. What is persecution complex, I wonder? Is it like a mental disorder? Oh, I see symptoms in the search bar, but he is. Oh, interesting. Interesting. And was it what I was gonna say? I kind of forgot about what I was gonna say, but now I remembered. Like, if they want this to be secret, why are they literally talking about this outside in the open? It makes no sense. But is that so? I believe 
そう、ちゃかすとかなり怒る。レナは普段はちゃらけてるけど、ジェイズはノーブタンブジーズ、ブリスヤーのシスマー。レナの前でも言うなってことだろ。ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、And if I must say, for your own sake, too, k e t o The first one is me on the shore. Yeah, so that, yeah, okay. I got it. Thanks. Saying that she worked her hand and began walking away. I must go over a little days and then start with the walking myself. Sadako's older brother, Satoshi, had run away from home, already been a victim of the curse and disappeared forever. Hmm. Whatever the case, none of this was everything, anything I should have asked about. The cooling air forced into self reflection. I wanted s a t o k o to smile, yet my curiosity easily defeated me, and I frivolously tied step to step in the dark side of things in a joking way. I'm shameful. I wanted the day to be exactly,、um, I wanted day, the day to be exactly like yesterday. I wanted tomorrow to be just as fun as the day, too. So why did I go and do something like that? Well, I mean, even if he has this, this knowledge, I'm sure the day won't change. <coughs> We were having a blast at the baseball game yesterday, and today we had a blast at the big barbecue party thing too. It was a lot of fun, but then I went, I went and almost nullified all those fun times. I would have to be more careful starting tomorrow. I would put all this unpleasant stuff behind me forever. Like, how I'm gonna let my enjoyable life end because of how careless I was today. Hmm. Yeah, but the more I thought that I'd be more careful starting tomorrow, the more I couldn't get rid of the honest and first thought that I had already put an end to all these enjoyable games and days before I just d o n e No, don't think like that, you haven't, Katie. Oh, hey, wait, I'm down my about a Katie. The years of destiny are freaking like j a n t y aren't they? Ha, <laughs> yeah. What happened just now was trivial. It doesn't make any sense to think that my life will be totally different starting tomorrow. But even though I understood it logically, the m i s n i g h t in my heart wasn't going to fade until tomorrow. It's really interesting about like the whole subtle sea related thoughts that Katie's having. I mean, it's just so interesting that, like, you know, he feels really bad for, you know, asking and seeing. Mystery me. <laughs> What a weird achievement. But, like, yeah. Ohio, Katie. Ohio. It kind of is the morning at the moment because it's 44 past 12. Hold on. My. You bet a nun's name is Ellie. I didn't know they were nice night at all.、Mm. Oh, I shouldn't have spoiled that for myself. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to go to bed now. That was so fun today. I really enjoyed that. Well, I mean, no shit when, I, when don't I enjoy it. But like, still, that was just really cool. I mean, Yeah, I'm really, I'm really excited to see like, how everything develops, what actually happens. Oh, God, I hope like, nothing's going to get worse as a result of these thoughts. But yeah, we'll see, really. I mean, I don't know. I really, I really enjoyed all of it. I love the baseball match. Oh, my God, I loved, I, loved, I loved even the barbecue, just everything. It was so good. But this is h i g u r a s i no Maku Koroni we're talking about. Of course, it's going to be good. So、yeah, I'm gonna go now. Gotta get some sleep if I can actually get any, guys. <laughs> so, yeah, see you guys. Hope you enjoyed. And, yeah, hopefully, tomorrow is just gonna be as fun.